guess I'll I guess I'll get started here, but uh, I don't know what's going on with my uh, my CPU usage right now. <laughs> like it it's at 75, 77 percent, but then suddenly Chrome is using 27 percent, and I'm at 97 percent of my CPU. Or suddenly Windows telemetry comes up to the top and is using 20 percent which I've seen that before, but I don't remember exactly what it is. Um, that's them just like fucking logging what my system is doing in terms of hardware, right? Maybe I should just turn that off. Oh God, this tab I opened has video playing, I think. Oh no, that's my audio was doubled. Oh, I know what happened there. When I reopened the... Uh, when I reopened the the Chrome window, it uh, it fucking didn't keep my settings where I always have it muted. Sorry, my bad. And it's really hard for me to hear that for some reason. Like I can barely tell that that's happening, and it's a lot louder on the stream. Chrome doesn't give a fuck. Um, so restarting Chrome and then actually pausing my stream seems to have helped a little bit. I was worried that. Stuff like that, like bit, like the cheers and stuff, would cause my CPU to spike up to 100. It might for subs, because that's a lot heavier than the bit one. But because uh, like the way I'm, the way I'm capturing this is uh, special. <laughs> so because this is a DS game, it has to represent two screens, and there's a number of ways of doing that, and one of them is to have one screen on your gamepad and one screen on the TV. Obviously, that's not gonna work. It turns out for this game, actually, the best way is just have uh, your gamepad held vertically, and then it shows both street, both screens above each other, and you use the, it, it, the whole game uses the touch screen, so it doesn't matter that you're holding it vertically. And uh, it also mirrors that on the TV. So because, if I were to just capture this with my capture card, I would have two small, little rectangles of video representing the two screens. Thank you, Lemon Hunter, for the subscription. I appreciate it. Spam Fig Newton in the chat. Um, so when I capture that, what I get is a lot of black space, and in the middle of the black space is two little windows of video representing the, um, you know, the, what I'm, like, each screen. And the problem with that is it's going to look like shit on OBS because there's a lot of black space. But I came up with a clever solution. You actually can't, you can't like crop two separate spots. You can't, you can't just take that capture and say I want this part and this part and then move those sections around. It doesn't work like that. But what I can do is instead of capturing it into OBS, I'm capturing it into my capture card software and previewing that. And then I'm doing two separate window captures of that with OBS, uh, which is actually a way that you get around the uh, HDCP protection for capturing PS3s in some cases. But in this case, I'm using it to capture two small screens uh, and then actually fill up the space on the screen because then I can control them. I can move them, stretch them all I want. Uh, then we have the problem of audio uh, because then I'm not capturing the audio in OBS. Um, so the way I solved that is I'm outputting audio from my Wii U separately to my capture card. My audio, sorry, not my capture card, my uh, audio card. And uh, I can select that as a separate input source in OBS. And uh, all we have to do is synchronize it and hope that the way I'm capturing the video doesn't look awful. And if it doesn't, then this should work. How is the delay on that? Uh, it's actually instantaneous, as you know, as close as you can get. But the the video capture is delayed, so I have to delay the audio to match, and also I have to delay my mic to match after that. <laughs> yes, it's captured with my noise card. Um, in theory, it should work. I've captured audio this way before; it works fine, to my knowledge. Um, everything should be good. The only problem is that. I have a lot of CPU usage from the duplicate video things that are happening. Um, so we're just gonna have to see. 
Is this another tech support stream? No, I think I have it figured out. I just have to see if the audio is... Um, I also don't know how the volume is going to be for you guys. I turned down real low to start. We're going to see. Yeah, that is. Um, thank you, Wookie, for the great bits. What's up? So yeah, this is uh, Phantom Hourglass for the DS. Playing it on my Wii U virtual console. And uh, tech support streams are nice. Yeah, they're, they're lovely. Starting real fucking late today. Holy shit. I spent so much time trying to figure out what to play and then trying to figure out how I would capture it if I played this. Um, today might end up being the day that I just stay up and do like a short stream later. And then we'll have our two streams. Like, because right now I'm almost a, like I'm half a day behind. I'm doing the stream for the 21st and it's 11, p 11 a.m. my time on the 22nd. So maybe I'll, I'll stream this for a few hours. Take a break, have something to eat, watch some anime. Then I'll come back and just stream a bit of Rocket League later or something for like three hours. And then I'll go to sleep. And then I'll get up and then the streams for the remaining days will be around the time that the Rocket League stream was. Or maybe a bit earlier. Um, start real late. Can you be late without a schedule? You can be late without a schedule if you are supposed to stream once per day. Um, you know, I, I give myself some wiggle room here in terms of the days, like where, you know, if it's 4 or 5 a.m. on the 22nd, that can still be the stream for the 21st. Just depends on how my sleep schedule is. You know, it's technically past midnight, but whatever. But I mean, at this point, my, my schedule keeps bumping up an hour every day. We're at, it's, I'm streaming at 11 o'clock now for the 21st. So, Wii U VC does allow Nintendo DS games. It doesn't have some that I would love to play, like the Castlevanias. Uh, I heard ages ago that those might be coming to it, but I don't know if that's still the case or what. If not, then uh, I will eventually uh, just, I don't know, emulate them and totally purchase a copy. <laughs> Streaming the new season, they're still doing all right because of ping and such. Um, I forgot that the new stuff came out today. Does it? Is it out already or is it coming out later? What is my scheduled sleeping time? Um, I'm sleeping from late in the evening until... No, I didn't wake up 10. I, I got up quite a while ago. Late in the evening, like 10 or so, I guess. 9, 10, 11, I think, is around when I went to sleep last night. And then uh, I woke up probably like... No, it must have been a bit later than that. Because I woke up at like 8 o'clock today. So I guess I'm up to midnight now coming at 10 p.m. UTC. Oh, jeez. Wait. Wait, hold on. No, UTC. Uh, UTC. What is that? I forget what I am, UTC. Comes out later. Yeah, I need to figure out what my time zone is compared to that. So it's currently 13.40 on the 22nd UTC. So I'm UTC minus two and a half hours. So that's going to come out... Um, what time do you say it comes out? UTC? Uh... 10 p.m. So that's going to come at 7.30 my time. Um, what Zelda's have I played? I have played the original. I have played... Uh, thank you for the 21 months, Fagan. I appreciate it. Um, I've, of course, played the, uh, the two Nintendo 64 ones, but I haven't streamed those. I played those years and years and years ago. Um, I think I actually played Ocarina of Time more recently on Virtual Console, but I definitely didn't play Majora's Mask more recently. So I could stream Majora's Mask one day, um, because I'm not going to remember anything. I could also maybe stream the other one too, one day. You know, because I probably wouldn't remember too, too much. Uh, I've not played Zelda 2. I don't have any intention to. And of course I played, um, the good one on NES or whatever. What, what's that one called? Link to the Past. Played Link to the Past. I played Skyward Sword. I played Minish Cap. I played. What else? What else did I play? Gotta be at least one more, right? Oh, um. What's the fucking GameCube one? Wind Waker HD. And obviously the new one. Uh, I've not played Zelda's Awakening. Anyway, anyway, uh, we can we can talk while we while we video game. Well, we're not going to be video gaming yet. We're going to be making sure shit works correctly, of course. But um, 
Have I played Psychonauts? No, although I've had it mentioned to me, and I don't think I was interested in it last I checked. My memory's not the greatest, though. All right, let's let's uh, let's switch over see how this all looks, I guess. Only one way to find out, right? So, as you can see, the main screen is big. You know, takes up most of the space. The screen down at the bottom right, right now it's just showing a logo. Uh, I think it's going to be like map or something later. It's probably going to be some kind of map or just info display. So that's pop down the corner, chat's above that, and... Uh, I tried the bit cup over there, but it looked weird with all the black space. Um, Link's Awakening is your favorite Zelda game. Huh. Maybe I'll check it out. Uh, so, yeah, it looks, looks pretty good right now, but I don't know how this is going to look once we start playing. Also, there's no way to tell how the audio sync is right now. Unless I do this, this is going to make shit look wacky as hell, because it's, like, it's not going to split the... Oh, you can't even see that. Wait, yes, you can. Maybe I can just come down here. There's not even sound for this. Uh, we can just open the game, I guess. Um, there's got to be some way I can test. Oh, maybe if I open this. I'm just trying to find something that like gives audio feedback when I select it. Okay, here's one. So I'm going to move it to screen settings. And uh, thanks, Wookie. You should hear a little like when you sele when I select it. Let's try to figure out just how delayed the audio needs to be because the the audio might come first. I set a 500 ms delay to start. I don't know how off it's gonna be. So let's try this. Holy shit! It it shows up. Jesus, I'm gonna need like a two second. De Is that really that fucking delayed? Holy fuck! And I mean, you can look down in the. No audio at all? Oh, I have it muted. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, just to be certain, actually, while we're at this, I had it muted because um, it's right in my OBS mixer, so I had to mute it for uh, the other part. Um, yeah, let's just let's listen to this first, see if the uh, volume is high enough. There should definitely be audio. Um, I've got it pretty low, but it, it looks loud-ish in OBS, so if it's competing with me, let me know. We'll do that first. Sounds fine. Okay. Please act out all the sound effects for us. <laughs> Too loud compared to me. Okay. It's it seems like it's quite loud. Let's try it there. Uh, that may be a bit quiet. See how that is. I assume the action sounds in the game are going to be a tad louder than this, like when Link's yelling and hitting stuff with his sword and whatnot. Seems good. Okay, now I'm going to jump back in here, and you can see reset in the bottom right. You can see screen settings in the center. I'm going to move down to screen settings. As soon as it's highlighted, you should hear a click sound at that exact moment. Uh, it might be pretty quiet, so uh, I'll shut up. Man, that seems like it's like a two-second delay before the video shows up. Fuck, I forgot to be quiet. <laughs> I'll do it again. That's a massive delay. It makes me it makes me worry that it might be climbing, like it might be increasing in delay. Um actually let me you know what I might as well do is restart the capture in my software and see if the delay is less. I'm curious. So um, let me just pop this up for a sec. I'm very curious. And before doing this causes OBS to take over the uh, capture and it like makes it so I have to restart the stream in order to get it to work again because my software can't get it to come up. <laughs> okay. Um, no, it seems fine. Okay, so now we'll... We'll see if that's any different. Oh my god, it's climbing delay. Oh boy. Yep, it's climbing delay. The, the video that we're capturing is going to become more and more delayed somehow. I wonder if it was because my CPU was peaking or something. How is it right now? How's the audio sync right now? Perfect? 
Okay, so it's not actually instant because I do have the audio delayed 500 ms. So it looks like there's about a, a 500 ms delay. This is just me, your screen is zoomed in. <laughs> we'll just have to wait and see. Um, is there an audio sync option in this? No, unfortunately not. This is like the really, really the only way I can get this to look good. So is it perfectly synced or should I adjust it a tiny bit? The only problem is I'm going to have to redo the capture every now and then if the, if the audio sync changes or rather if the video becomes more delayed. Sounds good. Okay. And also I saw some people saying that I could turn it, uh, um, Turn it up a little bit, so I'll try that too. Just put it like... Maybe right there. Uh, so we'll try this for a while, see if it ends up getting all fucky. Um, if it does, then I guess we'll just see. Alright. I think everything should be good, so... Give it a try. Wait a second. Wait, why do I already have my... What? Oh, it put my Nintendo name in there or whatever. <laughs> Wait, does this need to be muted again? Thought I heard double audio for a second there, but I don't. It's fine. Uh, I guess we'll put it as long. Oh, by the way, here's another thing. Shit. I'm looking down at the gamepad the way I'm doing this. Maybe if I put it up on the desk? Because, like... What I was doing is I was looking down at the gamepad, which could um, cause my... Oh, sorry about the cursor. Cause my gamepad to be... Or not my gamepad, fuck. Cause my voice to sound distant or different. Um, so does this sound any different right here? I'm assuming it does. This probably sounds less loud, right? I could try to bring it up here, and then now I'm like right up by the mic. A little awkward for me. Any difference there for you guys? Like if I if I'm like this, kind of talking down instead of forward. You don't hear anything different. It is different, a little less loud. It's a little, it's a little less loud, but it doesn't sound bad. Hold on, let me let me just talk like this for a minute. Currently, I'm looking down at my gamepad, so. We'll just stay like this for a few minutes. Oh, the other problem is I'm going to have to look up every time I want to look at chat. I guess I'll try just holding the gamepad up here. It's just a little tiny bit awkward. Do you hold the stylus in your right or left hand? My right hand. I do use my right hand. Oh, also, let me move OBS out of the way. It's kind of blocking chat for me. This should be fine. Like, this should be the same as always right now. Too few O's. <laughs> we could. Okay. All right. Let's let's satisfy the uh, the Twitch chat. Maximum O's, of course. L O O O O O. N K. There we go. There we go. Please hold the stylus in your mouth like a normal person. I don't think that's how that works. Holding Wii U gamepad. <laughs> holding a brick would be more comfortable. <laughs> uh, it's a bit heavy holding it up like this, but... I don't know. I can live with it for now. Now we can start, yes. There we go. Thank you, Skillovich, for the 26 months of support. I appreciate it. Uh, how about... Adventure? <laughs> that sounds good. Our story begins not long ago. There was a young girl, savvy to the seas, and head of a band of pirates. Her name was Tetra. She was pretty, brash, and brave. Tetra and her handsome pirates set out to explore the vast and unfamiliar seas. One day, on a stop at an island, Tetra met a young boy dressed in green. I did play Wind Waker HD. After a series of strange events, the two began traveling together. 
I don't mind the Wii U gamepad in general, but I have to hold it vertically. I have to hold its weight with my left hand. <laughs> they found old ruins and light enveloped Petra. At once, she transformed into a beautiful princess. Her lineage traced back to an ancient, ruined kingdom. She was Princess Zelda of the Kingdom of Hyrule. Yeah, it's gonna look... Just then, a huge, ominous king appeared. I'll, I'll say my piece after this. He carried Princess Zelda away. The evil king sought the sacred power passed down to Hyrulean princesses. He schemed to take the power and use it himself. The boy chased after him, determined to save the princess. You're the only one laughing while looking at Link's face. I doubt it. <laughs> it's pretty silly looking. The boy crossed seas and climbed mountains. The journey was perilous. He slayed evil monsters and used their power to become a true hero. Yeah, so this is in the in the Wind Waker universe. Got it. After long and hard adventuring, he defeated the evil king. Long and hard. Am I right, guys? Hold on. Let me let me put an eight equals 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 D in the chat. Beautiful Princess Zelda was rescued at last. Shut up, Bliss. <laughs> Later, the two set out with a brave pirate crew in search of new lands. Yes, they set sail together. <laughs> a happy pirate ending. The story. So, what did you think of my amazing paper cutouts? Oh god, how bad does this look to, <laughs> to you guys on stream? I have to maximize OBS and look at this. Holy shit, those pixels. Unfortunately, this hat actually has nothing to do with the capture whatsoever. There's no way to make this look better. What I was going to say is this is 256 by 196 resolution. That's what this runs at. They did not upscale it for the Wii U Virtual Console. This is as good as it gets. And <laughs> that's, it. That's, as, that's it. That's as good as it gets. So... I guess we'll just have to deal with the DS resolution. It does not look good on big screens. <laughs> That's just how it is. Did you guess that Tetra was really Princess Zelda? They didn't upscale. No, they didn't. Hey, long! Are you sleeping, Swappy? 6K bitrate, yeah. <laughs> Streaming this at 6 megabits per second. <laughs> hey, long, are you sleeping, Swappy? Oh man, those are some pixels. Long! Long! <laughs> Looks great. The left side having it, like the, the little black bars and stuff, it's just the way that the they don't have it full screen on the screen. In a manner of speaking, it's just really, it's just gonna change around. I guess it'll fill it all when, it, when we get to the game or something. Stop messing around down there. You're both supposed to be on lookout. At least the chat is in HD. <laughs> Isn't there that smoothing option on Wii VC? I can check. This is gonna look weird for you guys. When you go into screen settings, oh yeah, there is um, smoothing on off. I don't know if this is gonna help. It's probably gonna make it worse, but I'll turn it on. Let's see how that looks. Ha, some legendary hero you are. Who'd believe you saved me from the evil king? Princess Zelda, we're nearly at that spot in the sea. I told you not to call me Zelda. Tetra worked just fine before, you know. No change. So much better. <laughs> Look at that quality change. But enough about that. It's HD now. <laughs> so this is where the ghost ship is said to appear. Stay on the lookout for a creepy looking ship. This is so small for me, like, on this tiny little fucking gamepad. <laughs> we HD now, boys. <laughs> you sure this is a good idea? What about all those ships that have gone missing? I say the ghost ship is behind all of it. That's right, Nico. Every ship disappears. And it's all because of that scary ghost ship. G ghosts 
Hey, Tetra. They say these seas are protected, yeah? My motion sensing trash can just opened on its own. That's so weird when it does that. <laughs> Something about a spirit called the Ocean King. Wouldn't a spirit like that protect the ships? In all seriousness, it does look a little better, but the resolution is the same. Oh yeah, I know. It, it, all it does is like add a filter. That's all. Unless there really is an evil ghost ship. Don't be ridiculous. There's no such thing as a ghost ship. She's like 10 pixels. <laughs> I bet it's just some pirates up to no good. I'll expose them as a bunch of frauds. And remind them that there are rules to being pirates. I doubt there really is an Ocean King anyway. <laughs> I'm already tired of holding this gamepad up here. <laughs> I may have to just um, think of something else. I don't know. Hey, look, the air feels chilly. Eerie, even. I say we take a detour around this creepy place. Quit being so scared. We're here to see the world, not take detours. Ship ahoy. That means there's a ship over there. Tetra, I can see a ship. Yeah, a, a ship up ahead. Okay. <laughs> Look at that HD ship. I have four kids in this game. <laughs> Don't have a tripod to hold that brick. I wish. I wish I did. Could maybe prop it up on something. I don't know what would be stable enough to hold this stuff. Like I can hold it down on my lap and it's more comfortable, but I have to look down and it makes it. Maybe if I just try putting it on my right, like right leg, and then I move my mic lower like this. We know how this sounds. It's the ghost ship. But see now when I look up at chat, I'm kind of above the mic. Do you hear the volume change from here to here? Looking down, looking up. Looking down, looking up. <laughs> any, any difference? Significant difference? It would sound so weird if I... Like if I'm just constantly going from here to here and... A little, how noticeable is it? It's the ghost ship. These waters really are cursed. It's fine. Okay. If it's not too significant, I guess it's okay. You call yourself a pirate. It's just a ship. The only problem is my pop filter's kind of in. Let me just move that. I don't need that. It's just a ship. But it does look like it could be the ghost ship. There might even be a load of treasure on board. That's it. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Just let me know if at any point you hear anything weird, like anything sounding too quiet, too loud, whatever. Oh no. Oh no. I didn't see what happened actually. I was looking at chat. <laughs> Zelda got launched or something. Oh man, but we're the hero, so we got this. Oh wait, but Link can't do a pull-up. <laughs> Link can't do one pull-up. I mean, he already had his grip. At that point, the Hero of Time should be able to pull his, his weight up at least, but okay. Rip. Long. Save me. Long. <laughs> oh, fuck. I forgot that in these older ones... They tend to actually say your name a lot, so setting it to Lonk means I'm gonna have to say it a, a bunch. <laughs> Save me, Lonk! Nope. Hey! Hey! Well, I guess that's in this game. I think that's how it actually shows where I'm using the stylus with the fucking fairy. Oh, phew, you're awake! You were moving, so I thought you were done for. But it looks like you're going to be okay. I'm Ciela. You see, I'm a fairy. I was out fluttering around and found you here. What happened? Oh no, it's back. 
I failed the quick time event. Rip. Thank you. What? A ghost ship? Wait, his mouth didn't even move. Was this a mind reading fairy? Your friend was taken away by a ghost ship? See, we're following after her, and you got separated from your own ship, huh? Is it the ghost ship people have been talking about? No, it's it's a different a different ghost ship, actually. They say that those it takes are never seen again. You want to know more about the ghost ship? Grandpa will know all about it. Two streams in two days? Try 21 streams in 21 days. <laughs> Thank you very much. Grandpa will know all about it. Wait, the fairy has a grandpa? I lost my memory a long time ago. When I woke up on this beach, Grandpa rescued me. He's very sweet, so you've got nothing to worry about. Our house is up there, off the beach. Come on. How you guys liking them pixels? Oh man, we are gonna be alias as fuck. Holy shit, look at that. Woo! Oh, you can walk? Tap the direction you want to move with your stylus. Oh god. Time to get introduced to the stylus controls. Oh boy. <laughs> I was reluctant to try this because I was afraid of these controls. I, uh, imagine that I'm gonna get used to them. How do I fucking... How do I anything? How do I, like, grab that? I guess all I can do for now is move. Did I read Zelda's diary in Breath of the Wild? I think so. Probably. Um, I don't know where she told me to go, so... You swear I'm turning into Ric Flair? What the fuck? What? <laughs> Why? Oh. Ho there, friend. Try tapping on me. Okay, so it looks like character's dialogue appears in the bottom right screen. Or rather, the top screen. How is that for you guys? Oh, it, that's only like before I talk to him. I, I don't even know. Yep, that's how it's done. Just tap on people to speak with them. Try tapping on other things, like signs and barrels. Or a cuckoo. Oh my god. <laughs> I did it. Uh, how do I toss it? Okay. Can I, like, piss it off, though? If I just keep grabbing it and tossing it. I can grab rocks, but not bushes. Okay. Got it. Sign says... Danger! Monsters ahead! Okay. Alright. Can you do audio description of what's going on for the people who are watching on large screens and can't tell what's going on? <laughs> Why? Because there's not enough pixels? Not this way! My grandpa's house is to the right! Oh. Well, you could have told me that. She probably told me that. <laughs> I think to the right means to the right, but let's try going up. <laughs> Maybe she meant to the right and then slightly up. Hello? Grandpa? I think that actually is Grandpa. What do you know? Sorry about your pots, Grandpa. I've got a real... real bad habit of accidentally tripping and tossing your pots. Alright. What's up? He looks pretty Grandpa-y. Ah, hello, Traveler. So your name is Long. I am Oceus. And I live on this island. I don't know if it's Oceus or Oceus. Ciela told me all about what happened to you. I also hear your friend was taken by the ghost ship. I understand that you want to find the ghost ship, but you must not. But Grandpa, what are you saying? Long's friend was carried away. Pure evil fills the sails of the ghost ship. It roams the seas in search of victims to capture, and no one has ever escaped from it. It's best if you stay far away from that ghost ship. No, to seek out that ship is to seek out your doom. That's why we have to do something, Grandpa. Oh, mercy. <laughs> oh, mercy. How about you just suck on my nut, inverted octopus? How's that sound? Hmm... You're not going to give up, are you? <laughs> yes. Young people. There is a port to the east of here. Spirit Tracks is also on the virtual console here. A sailor by the name of Linebeck should be there. He will be willing to tell you more about the ghost ship. Look at your map. 
The harbor is here. That actually looks pretty decent, the way I have that captured. I wasn't sure how it was going to be, but... It looks pretty good. You mean that guy who came to visit, Grandpa? He asked about the ghost ship. I remember him. Also, um, it's come to my attention that the way it has it, uh... Kind of... What would you call that? Letterboxed or whatever? Is just permanent. Um... So maybe I should stretch it so that those sides are not... Like you see on the on the left side, there's a black line. I, I don't like that. I could probably fix that pretty easily. Uh, let me see. Just move that like that, and then... This could be slightly bigger. Move over slightly. Like the the black on the right is okay because it's almost like a little uh, separation between the main screen and the chat and stuff. That's pretty good, like that. I think. Got rid of the black line. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Seems like it didn't work, Rip. Nice try, Ivy. Nice try. Ow, 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 Thank you, Sonata. Uh, I don't know, Lahiel. It's, it's looked like this since I turned it on. Hard to say. Okay, thanks. Um, what did she say at the end? L O O O O A U. What was that? How is that N K? O O A U. Anyway, I'll go with Lonk and show him who he is. It's okay, right, Grandpa? Yes, I don't see why you can't go along. I'm sure you can help Lonk. Thank you, Grandpa. Let's go, Lonk. <laughs> oh, what have I done to myself? <laughs> why? Why did I put all these O's in here? I'm going to have to do that so many times. She's always been antsy, that one. Now, Lonk! Lately, there have been many monster sightings. I gave in to you and told you about Lineback. But you can be careful out there. You can? Okay, let's just add words. Why not? That's totally worth the five dollars. Hey, I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, hold on a second. Hold on now. I think it's actually filling all of the space now. I think I need to undo that crop. I think it's just during cutscenes. Because if I move this over, yeah, there's still more game. Oh, well. I guess we'll just deal with a tiny black line during cutscenes. It's fine. Life goes on. Um, so now this needs to be... Size down just a bit. Well, actually... No, yeah, that, that should be like... Like that. It's so hard to see if there's a tiny line there. I think there's a one pixel line. Okay. I guess that's good. That's probably okay. That voice acting. It's not voice acting. Just because I yell lonk doesn't mean I'm voice acting. Please. Okay, that's fine. Oh, my bit cup looks weird. God damn it. Why am I so picky? Why am I so... God damn it. Please. Okay. We're going to be covering some stuff in the bottom corner. But oh well. Oh well, it's fine. Alright, anyway. Back to the game. Let's destroy the rest of his pots. I didn't see these. Got to do that before I go. What kind of, uh, what kind of link would I be if I didn't destroy all his pots? Oh! He went out and bought new pots in the time that it took me to talk to him. That was some good multitasking. Also, I guess we can wreck his barrels, too. Rip all of his things. 
Well, no, it's not. It's not about like getting an extra pixel of resolution. It's, it's about um, just not having a weird looking line there. Don't bother some people. I might as well have it fixed. Oh. What? <laughs> oh God. She actually says hey every single time she wants to talk. Lovely. Uh, what's that rumbling? Another earthquake? So many quakes lately. So many monsters. Bad signs for sure. And I bet there are even worse things to come. Is it bothering you guys that it's covering the menu thing? I could do this. Um, can move it up like that. Also, this is not even the correct size. It's supposed to be larger, really. It doesn't need to be, though. You could, like, put it up here. It's triggering me. <laughs> uh. hmm. Something like that. How's that? Or even down here. In the Discord there. What do you prefer? Up top or on the right? Put the cup in the very center so it doesn't cover anything. Problem solved. <laughs> Left or right? What do you think? I can't decide. Right? Top? <laughs> nah, the other way. Top so it doesn't cover dialogue. Oh, right. I didn't think of that. That might be a thing. Okay. We'll try that for a, for a while. See if it ends up working well. Alrighty, back to the video again. So obviously I'm going in this cave. I don't actually, actually yes I do. I was gonna say I don't remember where they told me to go. They told me to go over to a dock, but there's a fucking cave here, so. Obviously I'm going in the cave. Don't think I'm gonna be able to get very far though. Let's see how the, the cuff looks in action. <laughs> Thanks Shadows. Appreciate it, man. Hey! Grandpa uses this cave as a storehouse. Ooh. That means I can steal all his shit. What if the dock is in the cave? <laughs> that's, a, that's a good point. What if it's uh, behind the rock in the upper left? Keep your hands off my things. Please ask first. Ocious. Well, obviously, I'm gonna try, but <laughs> I don't think, I don't think I'm able to get out there. All right. Man, I gotta... <laughs> I gotta break this habit. Every time I see one, I gotta break one. It'll just keep giving bits till we get sassy fairy. All right, Mentos. Works for me. Doesn't that kind of work? Um, the opposite of how you want it to work, though. If I don't do the sassy thing, then you just keep giving me money. So that's kind of what I want. Oh heavens! That quake just broke the bridge again. So many quakes lately, and the bridge breaks every time there's a big one. There's a second way to get to town, fortunately. Unfortunately, it leads through a frightening cave full of monsters. Hmm. How about... It looks like the dialogue goes up there. Maybe that? How's that? I don't know. Or if we did put it down here. It, it still covers some that way. But something like this... Works pretty well for me. Should be good. Alright. What to do? Well, wait for the bridge to be fixed, of course. Or... I could, uh... Go through the frightening cave? I guess? Yeah, a heart that I don't need. How come Lonk is able to lift rocks but wasn't able to stay on the ship? Is that a conspir and conspiracy? Was the handle on the ship waxed? Please explain. Uh, I appear to have inadvertently tapped the water while looking at chat. Um, the answer to that question is video games. Let's go ask Grandpa. Maybe he can help me go through his storehouse. Hey, Grandpa. So that earthquake broke the bridge again, did it? Ah, uh, unfortunate. There is another way to the port, but it's far too dangerous. Now, wait for someone to rebuild the bridge. That's the only safe course. Don't even think about braiding the path to the north. The path to the north, you say. 
Well, it's a good thing he mentioned that. That's pretty helpful. Half to the north it is. I still don't have a sword, do I? Monsters, look out, Lonk! It's way too dangerous. You need something to defend yourself with. We have to go back. Is there like a stick I can find or something, maybe? Let's look for a stick. I don't want to talk back. Ignoring me? See you later then. Yeah, fuck you too. Maybe he has a stick in his house. Uh, I better not be thinking about it. <laughs> what, going through the north? I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about going without a weapon too. If you can believe that. I'm pretty crazy. I don't know. You never know what I might do. Throw the chicken to the monsters. <laughs> and then the chicken will just summon an army of, of friends to help. Okay, it doesn't look like I can get a weapon, so I think I'll just run and avoid them. Maybe toss rocks at them or something. Uh, he probably had to drop it when he uh, was in the water. Perfidious, or else he would have drowned from all the weight. I'm sure there's a logical reason like that. Totally. A save statue or what? Tapping it does nothing. Okay. Fair enough. Good thing these monsters are so slow, right, guys? Oh, here's the here's the dangerous cave. How the fuck do I get around this tree? What the hell? I'm so mad. Is there no way through? Do I need to get a sword? I don't think I can. Tapping a tree does nothing. What if I tap the enemy? It does nothing. I guess I'll go back and ask the, uh, ask the old man if he has a weapon or something. Off to a good start. Man, I can't decide which way I want to do this. Every way I hold the gamepad is just awkward. Every way I sit is just awkward. Just clip through it, easy. Probably would be. Okay. I need help, Grandpa. I'm dumb. Tried the path to the north, did you? Ciela, don't pretend you forgot I told you never to go that way. We've seen so many quakes rattle the island lately. Lately, Lonk. And monsters have been seen closer and closer to town. Be cautious, young ones. That cave up north leads to the port, it's true. But that path will be crawling with monsters. Do not even think of it. I'm sure someone will get around to repairing the bridge. Well, Grandpa wants us to stay out of trouble, but we need to find your friend. If only you found a sword, then you could show those monsters. <laughs> you don't say. You don't say. If only I found a sword. I guess I'll try Grandpa's storehouse again. Maybe there's some reason I can, like, I don't know, get further. Maybe I needed to tap on that thing and I was too dumb or something. I'm gonna go try that. Has to be a way. What if I toss a rock at it? I think I remember Grandpa storing a sword back there. You don't say. Now, how to get this door open? I remember he cracks open the door by running a number on that sign. I think he says it's the number of palm trees on the beach. Sneaky. Are you kidding me? Please. Keep your hands off my things. Please ask first. Oh, shiz. Um... Why would I go to the beach? The fuck? Just write numbers until it works. <laughs> Easy game. All right, we got us a sword. Nice. You got Osha's sword. Tap an enemy or slide the stylus on the touch screen. Rex, you whore, please. You slut, why am I all these sexually disparaging names? You found a sword. Oh, we shouldn't tell Grandpa we're taking it. He'd worry himself sick. Good for us, though. Now we can defend ourselves from those monsters. Is that a number to me? What, seven? I think so. Um, Pretty intuitive. Slashing is how you use the sword. What if I do a circle? Aha! Crafty. What if I... Hmm, never mind. All right, let's read this thing. Probably directions for the sword. I knew it. 
Go to the beach and count the trees. I'll go take a look if it's funny or something. Basics, number one. Use the stylus to swing your sword. Tapping and drawing lines quickly is the key to deft sword play. That's it? I thought maybe there'd be more after that. Alright. The minute you join the stream, I cheese something of course. Would you have it any other way? Truly? Is Rex streaming at the high bit rate? Switch his legs and studies for me. High doesn't look too bad quality wise though. Yeah, it shouldn't look much different besides the chat, because this game is 256 by 196 pixels per screen, so. I am streaming at six megabits per second, yes. Um if enough people have issues with it, I could drop it down in the future though. I don't know. That's great, Lyle. <laughs> nice. You two are proving to be quite a handful. Isn't that my sword? What do you plan on doing with it? Grandpa, I'm sorry, but we just had to. We can't abandon his kidnapped friend. We can't wait for the bridge. It says 5k for you. Yeah, it's never going to be uh, exactly. It's, it's usually a bit under until a lot happens and then it spikes above. It's more of an average. It's probably struggling to even fill that much bitrate with what we have here. <laughs> Yes, I understand, but I can't just let you go. Not without showing you how to handle that sword. I'll teach you how to handle it. Meet me at my house. Long! Thank you, SoapDish290, for the 10 months of support. Spam some potato salad in the chat. What the fuck does that even mean? Your playback rate is 300 kilobits per second on medium. Nice. Long! So, you have the sword, then know that even the best swords can be bad. If mishandled, that is. So I must teach you the basics of sword play. I didn't say Fig Newton, that was the previous one. <laughs> Let's begin with the targeted attack. I'm gonna bring out some targets for sword practice, far safer than real foes. Just tap a target to lock on and close in for the attack. Try it now. That's pretty easy. Easy peasy. Man, it's so warm in here. Hold on. This happens like every stream, but I have to turn my heat on. Off. One sec. Turn on my fan too. It's actually just insanely warm out today, considering it's uh, you know there's still fucking snow everywhere. All right, excellent. The targeted attack is the most basic of attacks. Use it well. Now for the side slash. When you find it hard to lock onto enemies, use the side slash instead. Just sketch a line that divides you and your target to slash at it. This move requires a little practice. Simply sketch to slash. Do I have to get close first? Yes, like that, and to keep slashing, just sketch repeatedly. Okay. Got it. Oh. It looks like you fully understand the side slash. Good thing you streaming this game is there's more difference between the chat section than with the game portion of the game when you switch it from source to low. What? You can also use it to slash several things at once. Remember it well. And finally, we have the spin attack. Slide the stylus around in a circle. The spin attack. Lonk. Guess you want me to go over here and do it? What? I was just trying to move towards it and it attacked it. Don't try out other moves. If you have a hard time unleashing the move, draw a larger circle. Fuck my face. I wasn't trying to hit the other thing, damn. 
Superb. I can teach you nothing more. Now you must swim on your own as you venture out among the monsters. But if you do have any problems, return here and speak with me. I'm trying to see if I can, like, rest the gamepad against my keyboard tray. I'm afraid it's going to hit too hard, though. Wow, Rex, how could you? Uh, thank you, Bizreal, for the 20 months of support. I appreciate it. <laughs> Still spamming the potato salad, I see. Thanks for that. Oh yeah, you can't hit those with the sword. Alright, let's go fuck up some choo-choos. Apparently this game is about 15 hours, I think. Probably gonna be more for me. <laughs> let's just say it's because of streaming and not because I'm Dumbo. Uh, boing oing! Want to do a somersault? Scribble tiny circles at the very edges of your screen. Roll into that big tree there and see what shakes loose. Roll too much, however, and you'll get dizzy. Uh, what? Tiny circles at the edge of my screen. Oh. What the fuck? What? I can't get it to... I can't get him to roll into this tree. What the fuck? I don't understand. Wow, that is hard to use. Like how close to the edge do I have to go? Oh, maybe I should just do one circle. No? What the fuck? This is bad. Jesus. This is real bad. I just hope there isn't any golf in this game. <laughs> Yeah, for all of our sake, let's hope that there's no golf. No golf mini games. All right, you're already playing video games like an old man. Smiley face, hard to look at. Ha ha. You think putting a smiley face and a ha ha there makes that less of a dick comment? I don't understand. Okay, so I've got a map on the top screen of the cave. That's pretty neat, I guess. This is gonna be, uh... It's gonna be really frustrating if, if any of the other controls are like that rolling control. Hopefully I won't have to do that too often. Oh god, I accidentally pressed ZR. Just like I was hoping, or expecting, not hoping. Alright. I feel like I'm gonna be relying on the spin attack a lot because it seems pretty efficient. Hot tire pony, please. Alright, open the chest. You got a small key. Use this key to open locked doors. Touch a door to open it, you can only use it once. Alrighty. You still keep me count of how many times I jump in the water? Well that one time I did it is gonna be the only time. Don't worry about it. Game is already too hard for Rex. Fuck. Just kill me. I was curious if... So can I like hold the move and then suddenly... Yeah, you don't have to take it off. That's neat, I guess. These controls are so fucking weird, man. I really hope I get used to it. Uh, hello? Let's continue. Rex is ancient. Yeah, I'm a, a whole 25 years old. Basically already dead at this point. Basically. Um, fuck, no matter how I sit, it hurts my back. Probably because I'm 100 years old. <laughs> when pulling the levers, first, second from the left. Pulling four levers. Where might those be, I wonder? Well, I bet this hint will come in handy. How about we write it on our map? To do that, tap the map icon, then scribble to your heart's content. Or just press down on the control pad, or the B button. Yay, shorts, shortcuts. Tap the map button, like up here? No, there's no stylus on the top screen. What map button? This? Oh. Okay, uh, what did he say? Second from the left? Two. Hello? What? <laughs> what just happened? Oh, I think I was touching this, the screen with my hand down in the corner. <laughs> oh God. 
That was, uh, woo! To from left. This is hard to write on. Jesus, beautiful. <laughs> That's gonna look great on the stream. Draw a penis to get used to it. Wait, let me confirm that he said second from the left. First, second from the left, okay. So two from left. Let's try over here, oops. Don't get my shit fucked. Uh, let's just see what that does. Mandatory dick drawing. I'll get around to it. Pull the four levers in the correct order, or else. Or else. All right. Push this thing to the right. Okay, you wanna hold it until you're done, I guess. Seems pretty decent to just touch the enemies rather than drawing the circles. I'll probably do that for the most part, actually. All right, I'll take the loot. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Pulling the levers second, first on the left, last, second from the right. Okay. First on the left, second from the right. So this one, this one, this one, and then this one. I did it. I gamed the game. What's the third though? Not like this. <laughs> you got a small key. Use this key to open locked doors. Touch a door to open it. You can only use it once. Makes sense. Keys often disappear when I use them in real life too. All right, let's go. That was a pretty hard puzzle. I almost couldn't get that one. That was rough. Woo. We did it together. I actually really like this game, especially the main mechanic. Apparently people don't like it, though. I've heard mixed things. Some people love it, some people it wasn't their thing. Uh, rip that harmless mouse, I guess. <laughs> that poor innocent mouse. Do they actually not even attack? Oh, all they do is hide keys like assholes. Thank you, Oni, for the Twitch Prime sub. I appreciate it. Spam Tom's middle name in the chat. Or what you think Tom's middle name is. Thank God I wrote the instructions on the map. I know, right? Oh, they're not harmless. They're assholes. I may never have, uh... May never have gotten that if I hadn't written that on the map. That would have been terrible. Okay, so obviously... We gotta block one side. And then trap him, and he'll come back out. Obviously. Obviously that's what's gonna happen. <laughs> Fuck. Maybe I can get him to go over there. Ah, there we go. Now he can't get back. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> you can see him on the map too. Neat. What the fuck? Why can't I get this guy? I'm trying to touch him as he's running by, but it's difficult. I'm just gonna do a slash. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, nobody likes you. Nice, thanks, man. You think his middle name is All. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's get that heart. And door. Amazing combat mechanics, thanks. I assume by combat mechanics, you mean my execution of the combat mechanics? All right. For the most part, tapping them is fine. Doing this, playing this game is absolutely slaughtering my back with my shitty posture. <laughs> There's just no good way to do it. No good way to do it at all. If it weren't streaming, I could just like sit back in my chair, but I have to be up, sitting up in a weird way for the mic and stuff. Oh well. Ugh. Reminds me a bit of um, the awkward setup I have to use for Metroid Prime. God, that's so uncomfortable. We made it to the port. It's so much farther to walk when the bridge is out. Now that we're here, let's look up Linebeck. I've met him once or twice. Can't say I care for him. He's an awfully big talker for such a big cuckoo. He's a cuckoo? 
Excuse me? Hold on, let me let me try this. Guess I'll sit like this for a while. Alright. Okay, let's head to the port. Uh so the port is down and to the right. I guess I'll just do what the video game wants me to do and go there. Sig Brx got the Breath of the Wild DLC early, I see. Yeah, I got lucky. Look at this remarkable ship. What do you think of it? It's a ship, all right. Rex Pliss? What? Why are you plissing me? Oh, just look at her. What a ship. Such a proud beauty. Time loses all meaning when I gaze upon her. You always pronounced it Linebeck, not Linebeck? Which is it? Am I saying it right or wrong? Oh, if she were only mine. It belongs to a sea captain what goes by the name of Linebeck. A fearless soul, I hear. He's seen the whole world, yet never seen defeat. What? You're searching for Linebeck? The captain usually drops anchor at the milk bar, but I haven't seen him in days. Linebeck? We're going with Linebeck. <laughs> Perhaps the bar owner knows where Linebeck has vanished to. All right. The bar owner. So I'm assuming it'll be clear which building that is from the inside. That looks like a bar, I guess. Maybe. <laughs> Hello. A new customer. Oh, hearty greetings. Lots of locals drift in here to while away the hours. Bit empty at the moment. But aren't you a tad short to be in here? Take no offense, sir. You'll be more than welcome when you've gone a little farther in life. Looking for Linebeck? Sure, I know him. And that chair there knew him recently. Linebeck just dashed out, saying he was off to the Temple of the Ocean King. I tried to stop that crazy fellow, but off he went to the north side of our isle. Did my ears hear that right? He went to the Temple of the Ocean King? <laughs> Dude, I got fucked up on milk the other night. <laughs> Are you are you lactose intolerant? Shit, I forgot to read that. Something, something, all creation. And that temple up on the hill was built in his honor. None more worthy. Sadly, a curse was laid on the place that sucks the souls from all who enter. None dare step into the temple of the Ocean King. So put it out of your mind. Can't say where your friend's gone, but I'll tell you this. Stay out of there. Yes, steer clear. That's what we all do. But the odd visitor now and then can't resist it. What? Where is it? Right here on your map. You're not actually going there, are you? Uh, well... You know what? I won't. I'm just gonna... Gonna cut the grass. Why would I... Why would I put myself in such peril? Something, something, all creation is what I heard. Brx is now God. It works for me. I don't mind being a God. Actually, I probably would mind being a god. That would probably suck. That sounds like a lot of responsibility. Unless I have no obligation to, like, listen to my followers. If I can just ignore them and, like, enjoy godhood. Are there any other gods, though? It'd probably be pretty lonely. Probably end up, like, choosing to live as a human or something. Yo, what you got there? Welcome, Chopper. How can I help you? If there's something you want, tap it. So... Is everything, like, everything feel natural when we're going into scenes like this where it makes more use of the top screen? Is, does it look, like, is it okay for you guys how, you know, like, she's down in the corner with the dialogue and then this, the shop is up in the, up in the main screen? Something looks like, okay, how much is the shield? 10 million? That's a wooden shield. It protects you from light attacks. Just 80 rupees. Okay. What else you got? Put it back. Quit? Okay. Looks good? Okay. Uh, nice choice. Not sure what it is, but look at the color. For you, 500 rupees. Okay. Can't afford that. This rare treasure is a Rudo crown. Does 50 rupees sound fair? Don't know what that is. I feel like the map should be the main screen instead. <laughs> Please. I was just thinking I could do more of an even split if... You guys want it, but I, I kind of like how we have it. For the most part, it's what we want. So that's 10 bombs, yes? That'll be 50 rupees. <sighs> Shield or bombs? 
Shield or bombs? That's a tough choice. I think I go bombs. Get a shield later. Because you never know what... Oh, you don't have a bomb bag? I can't sell bombs to people without bags. Oh, well, fuck me then. I guess I'll buy the shield, you fuck. Can't just give me a shopping bag. <laughs> you don't have a bomb bag? Get the fuck out. You got the wooden shield. Defend yourself from minor attacks just by holding it. Right, so I figured, considering the control scheme, that it's just gonna passively... It's almost... It's almost just like a defense up. I suppose. Twitch changed. I don't like change. I haven't, haven't uh, gotten the changes yet on my end. It's like Rex has never played Zelda before. <laughs> Shut up! I've played one or two. It's a passive. Yeah. Right. Yeah, my shield won't break 50 times. It'll probably break if a flame enemy hits me. Considering it's, uh, you know, wood. Other than that, though, it should be good. We should be good to go. Oh no, the guy went under the tree. I was still able to get him, though. Alright. What do we do here? Nothing is what we do there. We fuck off is what we do. Is that thing attacking me? <laughs> it's a fucking random bird trying to attack me. I think it just looked like it. Oh, well. There you go. This is my first playthrough, yeah. Never seen or played this game. Am I gonna get all the Koroks in this game? How many are there, 10,000? I can do that. Uh, that's obviously something we wanna bomb later, so. Let's do this. B for bomb. Good stuff. Nice. Making good use of the map. Like a professional gamer. Um. Hey! hey. Risen! As long as I can kill Gain in the next three minutes, world record pace. Oh, that should be easy. Aha! So this is the Temple of the Ocean King. Legend has it the temple was built to honor the mighty Ocean King. But the temple has fallen into ruin, and people say it ruins any who enter. It's fallen into ruin, and it ruins you. Haha. <laughs> Still, we have to find Lineback. So let's dive right on in, Lonk! Uh, I mean, that sounds pretty good to me. You will hate this temple, is that so? Well, thanks, Frankie. Let's see. <laughs> in three hours, he'll be like, B. Hmm, it's probably for Big Dick. <laughs> Whoa, look, Lonk. Looks like someone's skeleton. What is it doing here? We should add a command explaining what a Frankie foreshadow is. <laughs> um, what is it doing here? You don't think this could be Lineback? No. I mean, he was here like 10 minutes ago. I'm pretty sure he's not a skeleton yet. This is really starting to creep me out. These skeletons are going to come alive and attack me, 100%. So even if you clear a trap, it resets once you leave. Should have made notes on my map. But I couldn't make notes on maps that have these icons. What? You're gonna stop me from making a note on my map in the dungeon? What kind of mechanic is that? Why? I foolishly entered this temple in moments that drained the life right out of me. Uh, Frankie Shadow is not so much a meme as like a convenient name for something that people do that I totally didn't steal from Para. <laughs> I entered the temple in search of the treasure. It's just when someone goes like, oh man, this next part coming up, you're gonna be so pissed. Or like, better better get ready for this next part, that sort of shit. People like letting you know when something's gonna happen. It's not like a huge deal. <laughs> I like pointing it out when people do it though. I entered the temple in search of the treasure. Mostly because I like saying Frankie Foreshadow. <laughs> but monsters that could not be slain with a sword stock the corridors. Okay. Sure. Guess I uh, should look around first. 
Uh, maybe I should buy one of those back break back brace things to try to fix my posture. Anyone use those? There's a fountain thingy, but I don't seem to be able to do anything with it. I guess we'll just go in, I suppose. I think I can jump there. All right, let's do it. Hey! Hey, wait, did you hear something long? I, I read something. Hey! Okay, I definitely heard something, didn't you? Hey, there's someone over there, Long. You heard getting crucified works wonders for back pains. Oh, I'll try that. You, kid, over here, kid. Well, that's what I'm worried about, Charlie. I wanna, I wanna do something about it before I make it really, really bad. Because if I'm doing so much sitting, I probably want to consider my posture. <laughs> I'm talking to you. You came at the right time. You're lucky you found me. Lucky for me, but luckier for you. Now help me. Oh, him? That's a line bag. Hey, are you listening? I said help. What is he screaming about? For someone pleading to be saved, he sure is rude. Oh, you're being a Frankie foreshadow. <laughs> hey, what's up, fantastic. What did you say? Oh, it's that chatty fairy from the old man's place. Yes, I got it. Listen, can you help me out? Just pay attention to what I have to say. Okay, dick. I know you're a kid and all, but try to listen up. I'm trapped in here and I don't know what to do. Normally I'd free myself without any problem, but I sprained my ankle and I can't move. Will you help? No way. <laughs> what? Wait. Can't you see that I'm begging? Come on, please. No. Kid. You're just heartless. You got nothing to lose. Come on, help me out. No way. Kid, you're just heartless. You've got nothing to lose. Come on, help me out. No way. Kid, you're just heartless. You've got nothing to lose. Come on, help me out. No way. Kid, you're just heartless. You've got nothing to lose. Come on, help me out. Fine. <laughs> you guys like that? I knew you'd come through for me, kid. Well then, <laughs> we live here now. <laughs> Do something about these pointy spikes. There's gotta be a way to disarm the trap somewhere around here. Fine, linebacker, just wait there. You want it five more hours of no way. Sorry, that was all I could handle. Let's help him out long. All right, let's. Oh, hey, wait a second. There's something I forgot to tell you. One thing you should know about this temple, it'll suck the life out of you. Why didn't you tell us that sooner? That's pretty important, you know. Let me finish. Don't go running away yet. I know it's scary, but it's not like the temple will suck the life out of you all the time. I'm not sure why, but as long as you stand on areas like this, you'll be okay. Show me that map. See all those purple spaces? They are probably safe zones. Were you listening? Did you get all that? I would love to meme, but I'm gonna say yes, <laughs> so he doesn't re repeat himself. Keep your strength up, kid. Don't be shy about breaking pots. Now get me out of here. Right, uh, let's go over to this corner. Ow, rude. Yes, like that. <laughs> Thanks for the insight, it's very helpful, dude. Ooh, big treasure chest. Nothing is there. <laughs> oh no, it's empty. I wonder if someone got to it before us. But it was that asshole over there. Okay, oh, there you go. GG. I can't believe, I can't believe it was an empty treasure chest. Are you kidding me? That little boy did it. Okay, I'm taking that as my cue to get out of here. Freedom! What a dick. <laughs> Is there anything special over here? No. I'll take some hearts though. Uh, I don't suppose the key was up here. No, I guess I gotta go chase him down, huh? Well, let's do it. Oh, he's, re <laughs> he's right there. <sighs> I think we can take a quick breather. 
Hey, you said you sprained your ankle. You're walking just fine. You said you needed our help. <sighs> it's not like you're the one who did the saving. Hey, kid. You're pretty brave for someone so short. I mean, not as brave as me, but not too shabby. So your name's Long! Huh? That's a weird name. <laughs> you don't say. The name's Linebeck. I'm a real man of the sea. Impressive, huh? It was smooth sailing for me in the beginning. But then I got myself stuck in that trap. This place will suck the life out of you if you let it. Blasted temple. What are you doing in a place like this anyway? What do you want from me, kid? Hold on, let me wave my right arm frantically. What? You're looking for the ghost ship? That was a delayed reaction. So you're trying to get your mitts on the treasure. Treasure? What are you even talking about? Long is trying to save his friend. She was abducted by the ghost ship. We came hoping you might know more about it. Oh, really? Boo-hoo, how sweet. I think I'm gonna cry. Oh, I'm just teasing, kid. If that's what this is about, I'm on board. I'm here looking for info about the ghost ship, too. I was just a step away, but I sprained my ankle. Otherwise, I would have explored this cursed place. Liar! I just saw you running like a rabbit! No, no, you didn't. That was just an illusion. My ankle's still throbbing. The pain is unbearable. Oh... Oh, the pain. Anyway, what is Link doing? It's like licking that guy's boots. Anyway, you want to know about the ghost ship? Go on without me, kid. Go grab the clue about the ghost ship. It has to be in there. We need to, to find the ship. Got that? You're faking it. I think you're just scared. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not a chance. Normally, I'd be leading the charge down there, but... I know how much it means to long! I'm letting him have the glory of saving his friend. So, anyway, here, take this with you, kid. I found this key around here, it might help. <laughs> That's pretty funny. You got a small key, it will open a locked door. Linebeck is your favorite character in Zelda. Wow. Tap the locked door to unlock it. You know what you've got to do, so get to it. Uh, hold on. Oh, what? What? I got a text message from my mom saying that packages are at their house for me. That's usually where I get stuff delivered. But she's on vacation. She, <laughs> I guess she's home now. Well then, one way of finding out. Alrighty. You just noticed the area map is an hourglass. Oh. Huh. I didn't notice that. Oh, and good luck in there, kid. Maybe that means I'm going to get the Phantom Hourglass. Hi, Rex's mom. Oh, God. Wait, that's not a door. <laughs> that's not a door at all. The dildos have arrived. I don't even remember what I ordered. Which is code for, uh, I remember, but I'm going to pretend I don't re remember, so you guys won't know what it is. <laughs> I assume this is on a timer. I'm just going to go. Oh, I probably have to do both in a certain amount of time. Certain amount of time. Oh, fuck me. Did that reset both of them? Oh my god. Fuck me, I'm already dead. Jesus. Probably dildos, lots of dildos. Yeah, you caught me. It's a thousand dildos. Dude, what? Where do we even go? Help! I need more health. Oh, there's some in there. Go there, go there, go there. Okay. Recharge. Please. Thanks. Rex blind. Probably a little bit? Slightly, extremely blind? Wait. Oh, what? I was like, wait, those spikes are already down, but no. I'm going to die. <laughs> I, I'm going to die now.
Oh, is it sitting down below? I'm dead. I meant to do that. I'm just getting my health back. That's all. I think it was the thing down below. I can't see because my screen is the side of size of like the tip of my penis. All right, let's try that again. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Literally lose no progress from that. Besides, you have to reopen the door, I guess. The first of many deaths, you think so? All right. How's my mom? The last I heard you talk about her was during Skyward Sword. Uh, you mean because of the breast cancer? She, I mean, that's ancient history now, but she's got um, a bit of nerve damage and stuff that she has to deal with. Like, uh, oversensitive areas on her, like on her arms or something. Not too, too bad, though. Could be a lot worse. Okay, so I think... What? If all that does is remove those spikes... No, it doesn't do anything with that. What the fuck? Maybe these will go down? Oh. Well then. Whoops. Okay, there we go. Really think he was joking about my mom? <laughs> nope. He was not. That was a while ago now. But yeah, she's doing well. Things considered. All right, my prize is a C chart. Oh boy, it's Wind Waker time. <laughs> Found a C chart. Must be an important clue to finding the ghost ship. You should show it to Linebeck. Wow, what a sick treasure. A map. Super eventual puzzle master. <laughs> Whoa, look at that old sea chart. I wonder if that's the clue to the ghost ship Lineback was talking about. Alright, uh, that's not the way back, you genius. Fuck this temple. <laughs> I like having health. Great, he left. Of course. But she wants someone to get radiation, could be way worse than nerve damage, could be here. Oh yeah, no, that was, yeah, that's ages ago. Yeah, that's pretty much all she has to deal with. Hey, where's Linebeck? Can you believe the nerve of that guy making us go in here by ourselves? Now that we've got the C chart, I've got some words for him. <laughs> this scum. <laughs> He's even scummier than me, am I right, guys? Ha ha ha. Also, it looks like if I put my cursor at the bottom of my screen, it ends up registering rolls, even if I'm not trying to roll, so that's lovely. Oh ho, if it isn't the little monkey and his twinkly pal. Slow getting the goods, eh? Slow? How dare you? You were quick enough to run off, injury and all. What an insult. I was merely hurrying back to my ship. Any captain worth his salt puts his ship before his own safety, I tell you. No, Rex. <laughs> not scummier than you. <laughs> Fuck you guys, too. Wii U graphics are looking a bit outdated. Yeah, it's it's rough. For some reason, this game only runs in 196p. But, tell me, little monkey. What did you find in the treasure chest? Call me a monkey, too. Jeez. Ah, a map. Let me add it. Bah, what's this? Some boring old sea map? Oh, now I see. It is, as we call in the adventuring business, a treasure map. If we probe its mysteries, we can find the very prize I'm seeking, the ghost ship. And by we, I mean me. Farewell, little monkey. I'm off to find adventure. Can I just literally kill this guy right now and take his ship? Did he really just do that? He muscles in on our map, then runs off with it? What should we do next? Meet Lineback at his ship? Or Linebeck? <laughs> Linebeck at his ship? <laughs> Dude. Nice shitty roar. Thanks for the 21 months. Again, spam, uh, 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 long in the chat. There we go. That works. Make sure it's the correct number of O's. If it's not exactly the same number as in the game, you get banned. Those are the rules. Hey, look, it's the B I drew earlier. That's for bomb. I remember. I wish I could move those. That would make my life slightly more convenient. That's not the correct number of O's. What do you guys think you're doing? 
You trying to ruin the chat experience right now? Putting too many O's and too few O's? What is this nonsense? I'm gonna attack a cuckoo. I'm gonna attack a cuckoo repeatedly. <laughs> I'm gonna attempt to attack a cuckoo repeatedly. It's actually hard to hit him because he runs away immediately and you can't tap him to strike. Kinda gotta corner it. Come on, summon your friends, asshole. Well, he ran right into the cutscene trigger. What a guy. You expect me to follow through on those pants? <laughs> Rex is running out of ideas. Rex is running out of ideas. Damn it, exposed. Well, look who's gracing our presence. It's old man Oshis. The bridge has been fixed, so I thought I'd check up on the youngsters here. You're an amazing lad to emerge alive from the temple. Long! Very courageous for one so early in his years. You sent me into that treacherous temple too, you old barnacle? Any who enter the temple unprepared will find it a terrifying ordeal. And most would lose heart and flee for their lives upon hearing me say it. But evidently, there are true heroes among us. Preen my feathers a little more, old man. Yep, I'm famous, all right. Not you, fool! You are a wreck! You'd be sunk by now if our young friend here hadn't shown up. I was injured! On a typical day, I blazed through one or two such temples before breakfast! Calm yourself, Lineback. Tell me what you've made of the temple's map. Yeah, they're really fast at fixing bridges. I've inspected it fully. My trained eye finds that it holds no secrets at all. But wait, old man. What do you know of this map? Ho ho ho. Has the map's puzzle eluded you, Lineback? I may see the map. Puzzle, you say? <laughs> A standard map would simply show you where to go, would it not? This is no standard map. You'll find that one section is a little flaky. Touch it. Flaky? I trust you can solve the puzzle. Long! Touch the flaky section? This? That? Can't see what I'm touching. I don't know what section would be flaky. The fuck? <laughs> I somehow am drawing on the- Oh! What? <laughs> I had to like fill it in? I was just spamming everyone on the screen at that point. That marks the spot of an isle born of volcanic strife. It is the Isle of Ember. That was weird. A fortune teller named Astrid lives there, and she sees far long. So you should ask Astrid if she can see where the ghost ship might be. Isle of Ember, eh? I always suspected there might be something there. So it's as simple as sailing there and finding Astrid? So we're off to the Isle of Ember then. Ciela, I'd like you to go with long. You'll be essential to his efforts, I'm sure. And by seeing the outside world, you might just find your lost memories. Will do! Happy to help. <laughs> that reminded me of fucking Mr. Meeseeks. Sorry that we have to pal around with Lineback, though. Still, I'm glad to sail the seas and see the world. What? Don't tell me that I have to haul around that twinkly bit of fluff, too. Ah, fine then. Okay, the Isle of Ember awaits. Ready to set sail, Link? Then climb aboard. The open sea calls. Alrighty. Off to adventure. The map is actually a lottery ticket. <laughs> it's off to the open sea with us then. I'll leave all the navigation to you while I stay down in the engine room. Okay, so now the fucking main game, the, like the ship is in the bottom corner. Tap the feather pen icon to access your navigation chart. Just draw a line and the ship will follow that exact path. Try it out. Who is Link? Who is this Link? I was wondering, I was wondering how you guys would react to that. <laughs> so many of you freaked out. Just draw a line and the ship will follow that exact path to try it out. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll stop. Oh, almost forgot. 
See the engine on the right? Tap stop to go. To resume, of course, tap go. It swaps after you draw the line, if you recall correctly. Yes, it does. While at sea, if you want to look around the sea, touch the screen's edge. If you want to look around the sea, touch the screen's edge. Stay alert up there. Touch up, down, left, and right to look in all directions. Uh. Okay. Interesting. Anyway, uh, root, and then I'll redo that. <laughs> how, how, how stupid can I get this? I don't know if it's even drawing anything right now. Let's see what that is. It just went there. <laughs> All right, I'm done fucking around. Let's go to the island. Let's go. And we're off. Okay, that's not so bad. 120 megabits per second down, it's still buffering on source. That's weird. Um, should I be like, going for that frog or something? <laughs> oh, rip. Good job, Rex. Thanks, man. Will I play the Zelda with trains? And which one would that be? Uh, oh, the port's down there. Okay. Let's go like that. Isle of Ember. Let's go. Literally a genius. Just thinks he can dock anywhere. Spirit Tracks is the one with the... Oh, Tracks. That makes sense, I guess. Um, I might play that one, yeah. We'll see. I can. I can emu emulate it on the Wii U, so... Looks like my boat has hearts. That's interesting. Neat. Is the logo in the way of anything, by the way, guys? The Rex logo? I could move that over or something. This must be the Isle of Ember that Grandpa was talking about. Also, I just noticed that fucking text changes locations all the time, so I don't even know. I don't know where to put stuff. It seems like no matter where I put it, stuff changes around and it doesn't look right. We're here! I guess it's okay. I could put the Discord thing, like... Not that, please. There, or something? Harder to see, but... Good enough. Not usually anything over there that's getting blocked. It's fine as is. All right, if you say so, I'll stop worrying about it. A sterling example of my helmsmanship. Impressed long! What? He didn't even know where the island was. Who sketched our course on the sea chart? Yeah, Long did. What? You piece of fluff, you just don't appreciate the finer points of sailing. But you get me, right, Long? There's a sensible lad, see? Long gets it. And as captain, I shall assign our little adventure monkey a task. Go find Astrid, Long. Meanwhile, I'll be waiting here, attending to the needs of my fine vessel. What? Staying behind? You're scared, aren't you? M me? S scared? I'm never scared, you little fluttering shrimp. You two go ahead. I'll be breaking my back working on the ship for your sakes. <laughs> Have fun with that. Someone with perfectionism will die because of this Discord link. Why? Is it like slightly off-center or something? <laughs> I need to move it a few pixels to the right, maybe? How's that? Better? Good. That's probably perfect, right? Uh, let's try going in here, I suppose. See what it's got going on. It's a pointless house. Good. Glad I checked there. Guess there's mail, but I don't think I have any. <laughs> Good day to you. What do you have for delivery? What? Okay. How about this building? Hello. I guess we'll read this. If you're reading my words, it means that I've fallen to fate. So look east to pick up the torch and take up my duty. Kayo. Oh, mystery. I wonder what happened on this aisle log. I wonder. 
Could have been anything. Oh god, I jumped in the water. Fuck. <laughs> okay, that's gonna be only... That's gonna be the, uh, the only two times that that happens. The one earlier and that one just now. Am I gonna stream for five hours as usual? Uh, probably. Might go a bit short if I end up planning to do another stream later. Not sure. Drown count. <laughs> Uh, of course, there's a drown count command. Oh, that's got to be your house right there. Okay. Where are you at? Oh, no. Oh, no. Now what will I do? I'm going to have to tap so many monsters. Look at all that tapping. Jeez, I'm tired. Barely managed that. I might stream twice in one day. I need to figure out, like, I need to fix my schedule somehow. The stream is too late. <laughs> so I was thinking I would stream now, take a break to eat, and just relax for a bit. And then I'd just do, like, a nice, easy Rocket League stream of the new content or something for a few hours, like three hours. There appears to be something different about the ground there, although probably not, I guess. Hang on, Lonk! I'm going to be pretty tired later by the time the uh, DLC comes out for Rocket League. Or whatever you call it. But, like, there's a new mode coming. I feel a presence on the other side of this door. Hey, I hear footsteps behind there. But this door looks pretty locked to me. What should we do? Hey, let's call out. Ready? Okay, call out something now, loud and clear. Oh God, does this use the mic? Uh, hello? H hello? <laughs> Do I have to touch her? Where's, where do you miss the mic on this thing? Uh, um, hello? <laughs> it worked. It, <laughs> who, who's there? Someone heard you. You did it, Lonk! Are the monsters gone? Get me out of here. It's safe out here. Who are you? The fortune teller, Astrid? Yes, that's right. Uh, it's not below the left stick. It's left of the home button. I was sealed in here to hide from the monsters. I didn't foresee one thing. I can't open the door from the inside. <sighs> I don't know who you are, but would you open it? Nope. What? How rude! If you help me, I'll give you whatever you want. Please, won't you help me open the door? No way! What? How rude! If you help me, I'll give you whatever you want. Please, won't you help me open the door? Yes. Thank you, and good luck, because this will be tricky. Now we can't read dialogue from the second screen? Fuck! Okay. Fine. I'm, I'm fixing it. This is gonna be perfect. Don't mind what's currently on your screen. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Uh, no, that's still too tall. Oh, hold on. I better take that phone call. Give me a sec, guys. I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. My parents just got back from vacation. I ordered them a uh, a keyboard right before they left. He was wondering if the box there was their keyboard. It was. It was a riveting conversation. Uh, yeah, my mic was muted because I was on a phone call. Okay. Um, how's this? Can somebody type in chat real quick? <laughs> As though I have to ask. Holy fuck. The last message is Miss Mary Max and nobody is talking. Okay, there we go. Um, I feel like I should move this up a tad. That's good. Right there. Ish. Come on, let's get it perfect. Get it perfect. There. Now it's not in the way of anything. I really like the way the chat looked when it was taking up all that space, but oh well. Oh well. Hello, Fox Project. Was that Jake from State Farm? I hope not. He sounded a lot like my dad. Thank you and good luck because this will be tricky. Okay. We're back. Do you see the map hanging beside the door? That map is somehow the key to opening the door. Unfortunately, only my assistant, Kayo, knows the secret of it. Okay, got it. So we have to find Kayo to learn the secret. Hold on, Astrid. We'll get you out of there as soon as possible. Okay. Off we go, then. He was on the east side of the island or something. I was wondering where the music was for a second there. There just wasn't any music. Um, can I just tap a point on the map, please? No. <laughs> I was hoping I could have auto walk. Okay, let's not attack electric choo-choos. Lesson learned. Also, when you get electrocuted, the map blurs. That's interesting. Interesting. Oh, shit. Out of nowhere. Also, maybe I should be rolling in all the trees. Please roll. Please roll into the tree. Please, okay. Holy fuck, 20 rupees. I need to be checking every big tree. If that's the case. Holy fuck. Hardest thing in the world. Maybe I just got really lucky and there will like never be another 20 rupee tree again. Oh my god. Rolling is so bad. Ugh. I can't roll. I left the screen accidentally. Amazing. Roll, you fucking bitch. God, another 20. Wow. That's insane. There's so many 20 rupee trees. I keep accidentally rolling while I'm just trying to walk along. And then when I try to roll, it doesn't work. He just fucking strikes instead. Are you serious, crow? Oh, nice. That's convenient. You knew this would happen. I don't know if it's anything to do with like the Wii U port or what, but having to roll or having to like spin the stylus on the edge of the screen in order to roll, it just doesn't seem to work. A fallen adventurer, look, long. I see him, I see him. Hold on, let me touch this spider first. All right, let's see what he has to say. And before it's her assistant, I think it is. <laughs> Brute force will get you nowhere. Ah, it's a ghost. Get him long. Ah, wait, give me some warning before you come at me. I must look really bad, but I swear I'm not a bad ghost. Well, to be honest, he doesn't really look like an evil ghost. You had a really easy time rolling in the DS because the edge of the screen is a literal physical edge. You can see how that would cause problems. Um, I mean, it's a little literal physical edge here, too. What else would it be? My name is Kayo. I used to work for Astrid, the fortune teller. Oh, just look what's become of you. Poor thing. Hello, Hydro Clone. What's up? If you believe in fate, then it's not so bad. I do feel much lighter. Of graver concern, though, is what's happened to Astrid. It haunts me. Well, Jazzy Trombone, I mean... <laughs> We're upscaling this to modern screens with 720p, 1080p resolution. This is a 196p game. There's not a lot of pixels. It just looked less bad on the DS screen because it was tiny. Also, that was years ago, so it wouldn't have looked so bad. 
We just saw Astrid. She asked us to open the door that locks her in. Wh what? So Miss Astrid is all right? Well then, please open the door for me. I'll tell you the secret. The three torches on this island are the key to understanding. Keep that in mind and you may be able to open the door. One torch is right here. Make a note on your map, lest you forget. Okay. Please take care of Astrid. Video is fucked? Uh, oh, it is, an OBS. That's weird because it's not on the, uh, it's not on the, like, the capture in the software. That is weird. Why is OBS doing that? Um, hello? It's capturing just fine on the actual capture. Wait, did it just move slightly? The fuck is happening? What is this? My CPU is not maxed or anything. Uh, I am confused. I am very confused. Why would it be doing that? The window that's being captured is still there. It's still full screened. The, what? Um. Uh, uh, what? This makes no sense. What? Um, I could reopen the capture, I guess? I don't see why that would matter. It's like, it's only OBS that's messing up, so far as I can tell. Like, the only, the only thing that's not working is the window capture of the, uh, the capture card. That's weird, man. Redoing it. If that did anything. Okay. Uh, sure, that worked. Okay, then. Good. Moving along. We missed half of the dialogue. Please restart the game, Rex. Seems reasonable. I'm tempted to take that energy drink out of my fridge, but I need it for later if I do another stream. Please take care of Astrid. All right. So, here. Oh, right. I have to do this. Here. Here. And there's another one somewhere else. Let's go find the third torch. I probably already saw it, but I don't remember seeing it. Let's take a look. You probably have to like tap the three spots correctly on the map or something. Hold on, I wanna see what was down here. That's probably something. But in terms of um in terms of the smoothness of the video, like frame rate, the way I'm capturing isn't capturing it isn't making it look bad, is it? Like I need, need to know if it, I mean, I'm sure someone would have mentioned something. <laughs> Summit path, approval needed for entry. Okay. Guess that's later then. Where is this third torch? Rings look fine, that's great. Cause I'm capturing it in such a weird way. It's good that it actually worked. I can't believe this actually worked out as well as it did. Do the wackiest shit to get this to work. But it worked out perfectly. If you guys are actually, I want to show you something. This is what it would have looked like if I had captured this the uh, traditional way. Actually, you know what? No, that's way too risky. If I try to capture traditionally with OBS, it might take over the card and I won't be able to use the software until I restart OBS. So never mind. You guys will never know. It shall forever remain a mystery. Where the fuck is this third torch? I bet it's at the center of the island. I'm betting you 20 cents. I'm just gonna put an X there and try it. Oh, well, I'm not gonna put an X there. I'm gonna pretend I put an X there. I mean, I'm right here. I might as well go try it. <laughs> You're okay with not knowing. 
Do that at the end of the stream. I'll forget if you remind me I can though. Mark the locations of our island's three torches. There, there, and probably there. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> the third one was wrong. Don't tap just anywhere. Mark only the location of the three torches. Fine, I'll go find it. Definitely don't want to trial and error this all day. That would probably be a bad idea. Let's figure out where it actually is, I suppose. <laughs> Wrecked. Yeah, I got, I got fucked pretty good. It's gotta be up here in the middle somewhere. It's somewhere up on this plateau. Fuck you. Also, this guy's here. For a second he thought I was gonna brute force it. <laughs> boing boing! To open the summit gate, you need what that fortune teller has to offer. Whether you believe in her fortunes, however, is up to you. Okay, so that's the next step for later, I guess. That didn't count, I was trying to make a jump. It doesn't count if I'm trying to jump across. <laughs> doesn't count as falling in the water. Very important. How the fuck... How do I get up there? I guess I need... to be able to go to that other path? Can't see anything from down here. Am I blind? Like... Where is this torch? It's gotta be up there. Hmm. Has to be. Has to be up there. But I don't see how I can get up there. This is as far as I can go. Every side that leads up there is blocked. Like, the only place I can get up would be through this gate but I can't go through that gate. Every other part is blocked off, I think. Hmm. I don't understand. Rex blind. <laughs> Probably a little bit Rex blind. Let's see, though. I obviously see that torch. That's one I have marked already. Where the hell is the last one? And before it was just like here in the top right corner or something. It's not though. Pretty sure. I can't see it from here. What did I tell you? What did I tell you about calling me Aaron? Jesus. Like how Rex's chat window just filters commands and bot responses. That is, um, that is just a feature of the, of Knight's chat plugin. It's pretty handy. For sure. I don't see anything from here. Where the fuck is this torch? Maybe I need to go talk to the lady and be like, hey, I can't get in any farther than this. I need your thing. So that I can go find the other torch. Or maybe she can tell me where the third torch is. Also, ow. I can't tell if I'm getting the hang of the torches or if I'm just getting lucky or... Or the... not the torches, the rolling. Jesus. Words are hard. Where is the torch? Also, I'm about to die because of crows. Hearts, please. Please, trees, I love you. Oh my god. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm fucking... I'm gonna die on this random island. It's not even a dungeon or anything. I'm just gonna die from crows. No! Holy fuck, that was close. Grass, please! Give me a heart, damn it! Oh my god, I don't want more money. I have plenty of money. I'm good on money. Please. I'm begging you. I'm begging you to drop a heart. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to talk to the fortune teller. Please! Can I not get hearts from those or what? I can get rupees, I can get hearts, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Nobody's made that joke yet, Dreslin. Good job. You're the first one, for sure. <laughs> Definitely the first person make that joke. Um, I don't know. I don't see any way I can get up top. I'm just gonna go 
Unless there's a torch indoors somewhere in that count. Okay, if you say so. Yeah, let's just put a torch indoors. Don't mind the smoke. No big deal. It's no problem. We don't need oxygen. There. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck your game. You touched the right places. I t <laughs> I'm good at that, ladies. And before that ends up on, like, live stream fail. <laughs> Thank you for opening the door. I'm finally free to go outside again. I thought she had a big old fucking beard for a second there. You bested the monsters who guarded me, so you are no ordinary travelers. May I ask your names? Nope. <laughs> oh, don't be so modest. Or don't be modest. This is long, and I'm Ciela. Nice to meet you. Not to my knowledge, HB. Surprisingly. <laughs> long? It evokes kindness and strength in the same breath. Lovely name. Thanks. Now tell me, what brought you to our island? Ah. <laughs> oh. You can't have forgotten your purpose for coming to our island. Hasn't something important brought you here? Um. <laughs> you're forgetful. You might want to add more muscle to your mind. Try to remember. Why did you come to our island? Err. Uh... Ah, uh, here's where we get into a loop. A ship? Lonk is looking for his friend who was taken by the ghost ship. Hey, Stormageddon, what's up? Wow, Metal Thug, rude. Aster, we were hoping you might have some insights. I streamed every day for the last 21 days, thanks. Is that so? The ghost ship came to our island a few days ago. That's why it was hidden away, to escape its ruinous reach. Speaking of which, I haven't seen Kayo since then. <laughs> Astrid, about that. Well, Kayo, he's... I see. I sensed it. Just as I foresaw. But it was destiny. Well, life has little use for mourning, so Kayo thought. Shall I tell you your fortune? Nope. It must be something very trivial. You don't have to restrain yourself. Shall I tell your fortune? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Fine. The illusion of choice. Please wait for me upstairs. If any others are with you, please bring them along with you to my chambers. Assemble yourselves and I will join you after I make preparations. All right. Kind of found it. You'd think that someone who sees the future would be on time. Where is Astrid? Let's get our fortunes told and be done with it. This fucking guy again. <laughs> Greetings. Now, if everyone is here, we can begin. Open my eyes to the future, a sinister darkness, the mighty sea and the voice of sacred light. I see it! I shall speak. Listen with your hearts. If you really want to find the ghost ship, long! You must be ready to clash with the very darkness itself. Knowing that, do you still want to rescue Tetra? Yikes! Really? If that's the path you've chosen, so shall it be. <laughs> what, Lonk? Treasure, I mean, Tetra! What, what about Tetra? Hello, Asariel here. You're planning to help her, right, Lonk? No. No, stop joking around. Now say that you'll help Tetra, Lonk! No, okay. Yes. I believed in you all along, without a doubt. Now, let's talk to Astrid. <laughs> okay. I foresaw your return. It's your fate, of course. Many trials still await you, however. Do you still plan on saving Tetra from the ghost ship? Fine, yes. Oh, very nice. The honesty in your eyes is crystal clear. Now make haste to the Temple of Fire on the summit of this island. There you must defeat the power of darkness that haunts that place. 
You will then find what you need to open the path that lies ahead of you. Yeah, she was talking as though I left. I just like turned around. <laughs> you have it within you to alter a doomed course of events. Long! But the light that seeks your help is growing faint. Please hurry. Power of darkness, eh? Hey, kid. I uh, just remembered I have to go polish the uh, ship's rudder. Later, kid. Sheesh. What's with the line back? Oh, let's just let him be and hurry to the temple. Um, I'm going to stand up and stretch real quick. so stiff or something so where are we going back to the ship are we just leaving you went to the temple long wait what linebeck you fled the second you heard about monsters in the temple N no of course not i suddenly got worried about my ship the captain's first duty is to his ship say long i was thinking that we should split tasks how would I take care of the ship and you take care of the monsters, eh? Unbelievable. You just don't want to risk your neck, right? What, uh, well, how could you understand? We seasoned captains have our reasons. Anyway, long! Off you go. Take care of those monsters. So I guess the temple is up that path that I couldn't go up anymore. I don't really understand how I can get anywhere new, though. I didn't get anything. I didn't get any powers. Hey! Oh, it's okay now. Okay, we can reach the Temple of Fire at the peak through here. Come on, tap the door to open it, Long. Oh, <laughs> that easy, huh? It's that fucking easy. Alrighty then. Oh, you fucker. Every time. Every time I go to attack those right away without thinking about it. And every time it fucks my shit. Yeah, let's roll into that tree. Nice, I'm actually kind of getting the hang of the rolling right now. I can actually get it like 50% of the time now. That's pretty good. I think that might be where the temple is. What do you guys think? Look, the volcano is erupting. Watch out for falling rocks. Alrighty then. Will do. The last two streams spoiled me. Where are all the waifus? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, rip. Now we're gonna expect every game to be filled with waifus forever. Things will never be the same. Uh, I guess I'll go back this way just to. Okay, there's nothing there. Fair enough. The only waifu here is Lineback. Lineback's a pretty good waifu. Discount Navi. Wow, you think she's inferior to Navi? To be fair, she uh, seems less obnoxious than Navi. That must be the temple, but the entrance is sealed. Yeah. Let's let's maybe go over here. Let's go to the one path that we can go to. How's that? I think that's a good strategy. <laughs> you got a red rupee. That's I don't know if that's deserving of a chest. I could just get that from a tree at any time. <laughs> Blow at the flames to illuminate the path ahead. Blow at the flames? Ow. How am I gonna blow out flames? Can I just like... Oh, I bet you I gotta use the mic. Bet you I gotta go. That's so dumb. I was correct. <laughs> <laughs> Any noise is fine, <laughs> as it happens, as long as you're pointing in the correct direction. Now we can enter the temple. We did it long! Let's go face up to that power of darkness. Let's do it. 
Temple of Fire. All right. Well, at least this one doesn't constantly drain my HP. Oh, so hot. Oh no, there are flames everywhere. You better not touch them. Don't go and burn yourself. Long. I don't know, with these controls, hard to say. <laughs> I might end up running right into them. So far, so good. Fuck you. Suddenly, we're Mario. Uh, I probably should have saved that. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, you know what? Fuck me. I can't believe I forgot to do this. I forgot to delay my mic the appropriate amount. Excuse me. Um, Yeah, I need to sync my mic. I've been probably early this whole time. Uh, okay. I'm going to... What can I do? Let's get out of this menu. Kill this guy. Um, what's the easiest way? Probably like this. Um... I'm gonna say now, right at the moment that I switch between these two options. Now. 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 Uh, see if I'm early or late. And I can adjust accordingly. I just delayed my mic by 500 MS. Tiny bit late, 58 years early. Hmm, those don't seem consistent. A bit late? Okay, so my mic is delayed too much somehow, even though that makes no sense. That makes actually zero sense at all. Voice comes first very slightly. So you, did you guys mean to say that my voice was slightly early? Because that's what Tom's saying, and that more sense. Let me try slightly more delay. Now. 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 Seems fine to me, TBH. Yeah, well, I only just added the delay. It was at zero before, so it definitely would have been bad. But not, it wouldn't have been too bad. But way late now. Try 400. Now. 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 Is that good? Or is, uh, am I too early? Perfect. That's so weird. If the audio of the game is delayed 500 milliseconds, that means that the, game, the video and audio for the game that you're seeing is 500 ms delayed. My voice should be instantaneous if there's no delay. So why does only 400 ms of delay synchronize it? It should be 500 ms. You barely even noticed I didn't have a delay before. Yeah, because it wasn't that much. It could could have been a lot worse, but but yeah. Anyway, back to the game. <clears throat> so what the fuck was I doing? It doesn't really make sense that less delay than the game's delay synchronizes it. Looking at the map, there's no way to get past to the left because there's fire there. There's no way to get past up there because there's a wall there. So there must be something I can do. I mean, there's no way I'm getting across there. What the heck? What to heck? Uh, where can I go? I don't understand. There's nothing I can do. Is there like a secret hidden path here? What? Rex block. Fuck. Ah, damn it, stop it! These controls! Oh, I bet. Okay, I guess I can't. Guess I can't blow out that fire. <laughs> That's a little bit too much. There's gotta be something I can do over here then, but. I can't get through. He can't, he can't make that jump, can he? Oh my god. God. So he was able to make that the whole time. Nice. Yeah, that tends to happen with a lot of capture cards, Nady. It's probably getting 
The video is probably getting delayed more and more with this setup, but oh well. Don't make haste. Make note of the one safe path. Uh, okay, so we want to go here, 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 here. Um, so basically, don't, don't go here, and don't go here. That's pretty much it. And I guess don't go here. Good stuff. High quality map. High quality mapping. Hmm. I wonder what that means, but let's make note of it. Go ahead. Copy that path by writing it on your map, in case we need it later. I did, Dumbo. That's what I just did. Jeez. Stupid game. Oh, no. Whatever will I do besides draw a bunch of circles? What are you gonna do, enemies? What are you gonna do? Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Apparently that's a problem you want to avoid. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. I'll take that. What you got for me? A small key, holy shit, I'm shocked. I thought it would be something else. What are the odds that it would have been a small key? Just what we needed to get through here. Crazy. Okay. Oh yeah, we're in the room where we have to follow the path. So just don't go there or there. That treasure chest should be fine to get. 20 rupees, holy camoli. <laughs> That's right, I just said that. Dude, why would you even need the map for this? They're clearly visible. <laughs> They're... The trap doors are clearly visible, and they even open for you early. They even open before you... Like, this should be safe, right? Oh, okay. So they're not visible entirely. But they open before you get close anyway. Hmm, the switch puzzle. Perhaps this? Uh... Okay. Not sure why it didn't work the first time. Alrighty then. A small key for a massive door with a keyhole the size of your head. <laughs> yep. Makes sense. It's only a small key. Okay, there we go. And, uh... I assume that that switch opened this door over here in the main room. But I fell into a trap door in the first dungeon? Well, I was talking about those trap doors. Those specifically. <laughs> The ones in the first dungeon don't count. Those were different, okay? Fucking every time! Every time! Every time! Literally every time. Uh, so I need to go around... So I need to go around him... So I need to go around him! And hit the switch. Fucking asshole! Get out of my life! Fuck me. Drop hearts, please. Ugh. Please. The one in the first dungeon opened early, too. Every time! Every time. A hundred percent of the time, I, I attack those. God. Okay. Another combat room. Uh-oh. That's several slimes. Rub? What? I got slime on my screen or something? Okay. I get lucky. What? What, Andy? Okay. We successfully rubbed. I'm uh, an experienced rubber, ladies. Got the boomerang. This item follows the path you draw on the screen. Neat. A boomerang. Know how to throw it? First, tap the item icon to equip the boomerang. Then just draw a line and it will follow that flight path, straight or curvy. Give it a try. Throw it around this room to get the hang of it. <laughs> that didn't work out. How's that? There we go. Rex is gonna love when he eventually finds a yellow true combat room. Well, it's fine now. 
Because all I got to do is this. I, this. There we go. There we go. That's, that's what I wanted. Okay, is there a switch over here? Ah, yes. As I expected. I'm really good at this. <laughs> nice efficient path. Easy peasy. I guess like that beeping. Is that pleasant? I'm only at half health, like what the fuck? Calm down, game. Calm down. Is that shooting fire? What the fuck? Don't shoot fireballs. Hold on, let's blow it out. As soon as I get a chance. Okay. <laughs> I don't think this works. Can I boomerang it? Perhaps? God damn it. Oh my god. This is annoying. Okay, let's try this. Why isn't it? What? Uh. What? The? Link, are you okay, buddy? Oh, that just adds fire to my boomerang. Of course it does. Get the things, damn it! Oh my god, okay, let's leave. Ah! Fuck! I'm gonna die. There's a shrine nearby. <laughs> he may be an experienced rubber, but blowing is not Rex's thing. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Um, let's try getting hearts from this choo-choo, maybe? I gotta say, it doesn't feel like um, the line goes precisely where I'm touching. It's like slightly off from where I'm touching. It's like slightly above or something, I don't know. It's awkward. There might be something I can do down here. Two deaths soon? You wish. I won't die that easily. See? I'm a genius. I knew these pots were here, so it was coming to farm hearts. So, I thought I saw a key on the map, but I guess that was on the second floor only, so. Let's go back and finish what we were doing. It's the Wii U squishy touch screen. Yeah. Guess it can't be helped. Oh, let's get that. Thank you. All right, there's probably some way to disable the torches, or maybe they're just there to force you to go fast, I don't know. Nice. I got it. Rex is gonna be pissed when he dies an uncertain amount of times throughout the rest of the game. Yeah, that sure is gonna upset me. When that thing that's totally gonna happen happens. Except that it isn't gonna happen. You gonna give me a hint? Boing oing! There are no treasure chests on this floor. Okay. You trying to hint that there are on other floors or what? Why are you telling me that? <laughs> what a stupid hint. Oh, there's gonna be fake treasure chests and now that I know that I know not to engage said treasure chests. I can only assume. That's gonna be the trick. Oh. Oh! Hmm. Assuming the boomerang works like I think it does. Wait, won't I lose my boomerang doing this? How am I gonna get it back? Oh, magic is how. Magic. Easy peasy. Get the fuck out of here. Excuse me. There we go. Now, uh, oh, I'm on the same floor still. Oh, I went down. Of course I did. What am I talking about? Okay, time to use skill. I <laughs> kind of did, I guess. That wasn't the one I meant to hit, actually, but let's just pretend that it was. Oh, my God. I still missed! <laughs> Fuck! There we go. <laughs> I can't believe I still managed to miss that. Amazing. Okay. So I can go up here now. I'm so good with the boomerang. Literal boomerang god. 
I should get it. Oh no, the other one. Hey, fucker. Oh my god. There. Wait, is it dead? Oh, it got knocked into the flames, I think. Am I enjoying the game so far? Yeah. The motion controls, the touchscreen controls are a little tough to get used to, but it's all right. Boing oing! The number of treasure chests left here is one. It'll cost you 20 rupees to see where the treasure lies. Oh, fuck that. That's your loss, or is it? Good luck. I got this. You think I can't find one measly treasure chest? Please. Uh, okay, we can make that. Oh my god, so slow. Well, this looks important. Uh, let's look around first. Oh, fuck. The hell? Why can't I hurt this thing? That was weird. Oh, wow, hard chest. Gee, that was, that was tough. I almost didn't find that one. Well hidden, game, well hidden. Excellent gameplay right there. Okay, hold on. I should be able to find a better, more comfortable way to sit. How about... It's gotta be, like, there's gotta be a better way to do this. How about I slouch back like this and put the thing here. Oh god, that button does something. I'm gonna accidentally press that so many times. Wait, are you telling me I could use the... Fuck me. So instead of using the touchscreen controls, I could actually be pressing that to activate my boomerang. Maybe I can, like, press it with my palm. The way I'm holding the controller, the L1 button is right under my palm. That'd be kind of funny if I actually do it that way. Activate it with my fucking... Oh, that's so awkward. It kind of works, I guess. I could remap the controls so that I could just press... D-pad buttons? God, all these controls. You have no idea what I'm talking about? Yes, you do. How dumb are you? <laughs> Please. Um, what are with these buttons over here? Fuck. Uh, seems like they all do the same thing. Hmm. I don't know. I'll probably just use the touch screen, I guess. This is so awkward, though. I can't find a comfortable way to sit and do this. Okay, so there's a switch thing here. There are blocks there. I guess those two levers I pulled out have done something? Not sure what. Oh, is it this? Oh. <laughs> well, there we go. That'll do it. Come on, you fucker. What? How did that not get him? What the hell? Hmm. He comes out that far if you go away. Unless you're drawing your boomerang, apparently. I don't understand. How do I get him to come out? Why did he do... <laughs> what is this? Seems random. What the hell? If I go down here, maybe? Okay. Okay. That's all we had to do. Just gotta time it now. Please. He's too fast. There we go. Get fucked, mouse. All right. Uh, I don't remember where there was a door for this. <laughs> Is the problem. Um, I think it's over on the... Wow, that's weird. When I... When I, like, click the map... Hold on, is the map capturing properly for you guys? Let me see. 
I bring up my map so that goes down there. It is, it's capturing just fine. But weirdly, if I touch the map part of the touch screen, a little like no stylus thing pops up for me, but that actually doesn't get captured. Oh, cause it's not going on the TV. It only goes on the Wii U gamepad. Of course. I am slight Dumbo. Let's pretend that didn't happen. I gotta go all the way back around now. Wait, did I not get this before? I bet that deactivates the flame. I thought my boomerang couldn't go over that, but evidently it can. There we go. That makes that a little easier. But what's the point? Where's the door I have to use this on? There must be another door up here. Wait, did PRX just solve something? It's possible. And before I totally could have done that screen back there, but I just didn't realize that I could draw or that I could like send my boomerang out over those walls. That's totally all it was. I'm coming all the way back up here for nothing because all I had to do was shoot out over the little, little lip, I bet. I just didn't think I could. Cause I'm, wait, where am I? Okay, we gotta go here. And, ow, fucker. Then we go over here and jump into every single flame stick. And all I had to do here was that. <laughs> well, it's not gonna hit him, but whatever. I can't believe that, that's amazing. Okay, don't hit walls. Okay, the way the camera moves as you draw is pretty disorientating. Disorienting, whichever. And now from here, we draw this. Keeps making me draw slightly higher than I intend to. Yeah, I played Hollow Knight a while ago. It was great. Loved Hollow Knight. Okay, we already got the key. That hurt, let me walk into it a second time. It's not like it was on purpose. You got the new Twitch layout, Kanthos? How is it? I, I still haven't gotten it. I'm not uh, important enough to be in the beta, I guess. Oh, the slime goes on your body and rubbing makes it fall off. Got it. Guess that makes sense. Okay, can I just like rub over the mic with my thumb? Oh yeah, <laughs> I don't have to fuck with it. That's perfect. Because it's so awkward to get the uh, the gamepad up, up to my face with this streaming setup. All I have to do is walk up to it, rub my thumb over the mic thing. Rub my thumb over the mic thing. Hello? Rub my thumb. Scratch it, maybe? Tap it? Use the stylus? Are you serious? Wow, I actually had to blow on it. If I remember correctly, can't you just tap on an enemy with the boomerang to kill it rather than draw the line every time? I don't know, but if if you're right, then you just spoiled it for me. You fuck. Let's see what's in this room. Quick as you can, flip the, the four switches in order. Well, that means with the boomerang, duh. Duh. When you see something of note, write it on your map. That's a key survival skill. You don't say thanks. So one, two, three, four. One. Oh yeah, I should probably actually write a one. One, two, three, four. Good enough. Good enough. Rex, it's a candle, candle you don't rub on candles. What, are you one of those uh, little sissies that can't extinguish a candle with their fingertips? Jeez. It's brave of you to admit that to all the chat. That you actually have to blow on a candle to extinguish it, like a little baby. <laughs> Gee, I sure am glad I made that note on the map. I never would have remembered this. One, two, three, four. Oh, jeez, that was tough. We got through it together. Uh, and my prize is that. Yes, you can tap on things. Lovely. Thanks for the small key. 
And I guess this is to be used here from the back. Neat. What's this guy saying? You're so manly, you piss on candles. <laughs> nice. The number of treasure chests left here is one. I don't want a fucking... I'm going to get it myself, you big butt. Whoa, what's this? It looks so ominous. That looks like the boss door to me. Gee, I wonder. So if you want to just hit one enemy, you can just tap on them. How about this? <laughs> that works. <laughs> works pretty well. Dude, this fucking torch, though. Why can't I hit this bat? I don't understand why I can't hit the bat until... It makes no sense. What is this shit? Just can't hit the bat with my sword. Rex, don't piss on your DS. Oh, I was going to. Thanks for... Letting me know that's a bad idea. I totally would have done that if you hadn't mentioned it. Appreciate that. Okay. I guess we're going this way. I don't really have a choice. Alright, let's try... I was gonna say, let's try tapping this guy, but he got too far away. Man, my glasses-headphones combo is really bothering me at the moment. All right, how about I just fucking do this? There we go. Easy peasy. That was close. I'm the fastest boomerang drawer in the West. That's what they say. That's what they call me. All right. 95% chance the treasure chest is going to be up here somewhere. When all three torches are lit... The path will be revealed. Okay. 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 <laughs> Good stuff. But wait, I can't get over here. Is this somewhere I've been? Oh. Uh... There we go. No. God, the movement is the hardest part. <laughs> the farther away your stylus is, the faster you go. But it's awkward sometimes. You try to get him to go fast quickly. Basu key. It's a huge, heavy key. Tap close to yourself to set it down and tap far away to throw it. Seriously? <laughs> I gotta do this? All right. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Fuck. Well, this is going to be even worse. Or not. It's actually pretty easy. So I wonder if when the, the statue said there's one treasure chest left, if he meant the giant one with the boss key or if he meant something else. I'm going to say that he meant there's something under this torch. But I can't move it. So maybe not. I don't know. I'm going to go to the statue again and see if he says there's another chest. What's up, Trelf? Welcome. Alright, that's the Basu. Let's see if this guy says there's still a chest. Boing, boing. There are no treasure chests on this floor. Wow, so it counts the boss key chest? That's real dumb. Kind of, kind of weird. 4F. Just in case there's money. This temple protects the spirit of power. Okay. Step into the blue light to return to the temple's entrance. Now, why would I go and do a sissy little thing like that? I can feel an evil presence lingering at the top of these stairs. Be careful, okay? Long! All right, boss time. What does Joe mean? It's just a stupid meme. I hate it. I hope it dies immediately. Someone, uh, I can't even remember now. I think someone said Joe instead of yo accidentally. And so now it's a meme. That's just it. That's the whole thing. All right. Let's see what the bosses are like. Hey, Elise, what's up? Things are going all right, I suppose. 
Alright, so obviously I've got to boomerang these jumps. Probably all three of them. Uh, what the fuck? Okay, so they wait a long time and then they shoot fireballs all at once. Let's just hit all three. And then fuck them up. Uh, or not. Let's hit all three and then suck our own dick, I guess. Oh, th what? Uh, okay. Okay. I guess I did something. Can't tell if I'm accomplishing anything. I imagine I am. Oh, he split again. All right. I guess you have to do that twice in order to make him become one. And then you can hit him. What? What did I do differently before? Or did the number of times just increase? What? I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I have no idea what's going on. I feel like a Dumbo. I don't get it. Why did he fuse that one time? But now he won't. I don't, I don't understand what I'm doing differently. So, oh, fuck. So I'll keep trying. I'm tapping on him and nothing's happening. And if I try to slash in front of him, nothing happens either. What? What the heck? Rex Pine? Maybe? Is there an order, maybe? Is there an order I have to do it and I'm not... Maybe it's the order in which they fireball? And I just got lucky that one time? What the fuck? How am I supposed to... What? Oh no, a three enemy puzzle. <laughs> Correct. Ah, I think that is it. Interesting. Might be. Come on. Let me get more hits in. I think I got it, maybe. Unless I got lucky. And I just got it by chance. Which is totally possible. Left. Oh god, that was at like the same time. I think I just got lucky, <laughs> and I still don't understand it. Amazing. Okay, so... Him, him, him. Nope, that ain't it. What the fuck? What is it, then? If it's the order in which they put their fireballs up in the first place, that's what I thought it was before, but then I was thinking maybe it's the order they launch it. Neither seems to be consistent. It changed now, I guess. Okay, so... Him, him, him. If it's the order they put their fireballs up. Okay, that's what it is. It's just the order they put their fireballs up and it changes every cycle. So you just have to watch for that and go quickly. Oh, GG. Low key, I can't even tell either. It's okay, it doesn't have to be low key. You can admit that you're as bad as me. I think I figured it out at the end there. <laughs> Finally. Rex is so smart. Wow, thanks. I'm sure that was a genuine comment. I'm not sarcastic. Rex, can I explain it? If I got it wrong still, I guess. I actually didn't figure it out. Amazing. The face one never looked at map. I didn't look up there at all. Did they have numbers on the map or something? Because <laughs> if so, that's amazing.
Use the bottom screen to see their faces. One has one spike of hair, another has two, and the third has three. I meant to hit them in that order. You mean the top screen. The map is the top screen for me. I am Leaf, Spirit of Power. I serve the Ocean King. Yeah, I didn't think to look at the top screen at all, so I just got lucky. <laughs> I owe you thanks for defeating that evil wizard. He broke the seal, so now I'm free. Long. Oh, <laughs> I thought it said long. Long! But it just says, Look, long! It's a spirit of power, Leaf. Looks just like you, but bigger and redder. Oh my god, I have hiccups. Fuck off, please. This must be what... This must all be what Astrid was talking about. Will I play Minish Cap? I played Minish Cap ages ago. Should be VODs of it. Please, help us. We need your strength. I was locked away with the Ocean King years ago. But now I can't feel the Ocean King's presence. I wonder what happened to him. If I come with you, maybe I can find out. If you need it, I will gladly lend a hand. Am I gonna get some kind of power? <laughs> that laugh in that face. The spirit of power, Leaf, has joined your group. You should go tell Astrid. All right. I gotta change the way I'm sitting again. Ugh. So awkward. There's no comfortable way to do this for the stream. There's no comfortable way to do this on the Wii U, honestly. Jojo, Jojo, Joe. Oh my God. Jojo, Jojo, Joe. Thanks, Ob. HP. Joe. Ob. Jojo, 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 Joe. Jojo, 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 Joe. Joe, Joe, oh, 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 Jojo, Joe. La, oh, oh, long. La, oh, oh, long. What the fuck? Please. All right, thanks, HB, for the 500 bits. Uh, I am playing this on a Wii U, yeah. And the way I have to play it, the Wii U gamepad has to be held vertically, and then the main screen's on the bottom and the map screen is on the top. And so I'm, I have to hold the whole Wii, pad, Wii U gamepad up. I could just put it down on a desk and lean over it if I weren't streaming, but there's no way to... There's no comfortable way to do this with the mic. The volcano has stopped erupting. Long! I bet it's because he defeated all the monsters. Long! Come on, let's tell Astrid. All right, let's, I guess, Wii pads. <laughs> I didn't say Wii pad. It doesn't run on TV, only the game pad. It's just duplicated on the TV. That's what I'm capturing from. Um. Okay, I have to try. I have to try to show you guys what it looks like on the TV. I hope this doesn't ruin everything. Wait! All I have to do is this. Hold on. I'll just create a third. Window capture. Uh, temporary. This is what it actually looks like. If it weren't for my uh, like crafty setup, this is what my capture card is actually capturing. This is it. That's like how it's laid out on the TV. So if I were to just use my capture card normally, we'd have to have something like, I don't even know, like, like what would we even do? <laughs> it's so, it's so shitty. You can't make it any bigger than that. Cause if, if you make it any bigger then that's it. Like it's, when you stretch it, you cut it off cause it's too tall. So yeah, it, to be honest, much better. Please. That's awful. The gamepad is big enough that you can actually see the game like that. <laughs> Just barely. So instead, instead of capturing it the traditional way, I am capturing it in my capture card software and then doing two separate window captures of the sections. So we have the main one here and the map one down in the corner, which is much better. And then in order to capture audio, I'm capturing it through my audio card using a separate audio output on the Wii U. It's janky, but it works. That's the main thing. Okay, anyway. Now let's, uh... So you can actually have it so that like one screen's on the, on the Wii U gamepad. What the fuck is with that? 
What is happening? Oh god, move. Why is that glitching out like that? What the hell? <laughs> you guys saw that, right? What was that shit? Capturing a captured image. Yep. You were wondering why the game looks so pixely? Well, it's gonna look pixely anyway. There, it doesn't matter what you do, it's gonna look pixelated. Because this screen is 196p. It's 256 by 196 pixels. There's no way to view this at a, a size that's reasonable on a modern monitor without it looking pixelated. This is just how much resolution there is. It has nothing to do with the way I'm capturing it. This is the best it can look. This is the best that it can possibly look because there's just no more resolution. That's it. That's all of it right there. <laughs> that's the limit, unfortunately. I might have to unbind L because I'm. It's making it awkward. I can't. I can't put my hand there. Let me do that. I think I can do that in here. Uh, can I not? Can you not bind controls? Usually for uh, Wii U Virtual Console, you can bind the controls. It's not in here. Controller set. Oh, maybe it is. No, that's not it. Uh, yeah, it usually would be in the in the emulator settings, which is ZR, but there's no way. Oh well. Can confirm even on the DS it was pixelated as fuck. Well, it was. It would still be as pixelated, but it wouldn't look as bad because it's on a smaller screen. Like, there's no way to make this look great on a big screen. Yeah, it's a DS game, so, you know. It looks okay on the Wii U, but regardless, it's it's pixelated as hell. There's no more detail. It's just clear how little detail it is when you... Or there is when you put it on a big screen. It becomes more apparent how few pixels there are. Basically. Hey, kid. So you were able to defeat all the monsters? Well, Astra is waiting. Well done, you defeated the power of darkness. Long! Thus you've broken the seal that imprisoned the spirit. You need to move ahead. Ultimately, you will need three spirits, power, wisdom, and courage. When you have all three, you will possess the power to find the ghost ship. Now two spirits remain, but the locations are veiled to me at present. I see another clue for you to find in the Temple of the Ocean King on Merkay. And to further your efforts, I give you this. May it help you in battle. You got a power gem. It radiates power, but you can't use it like this. Store it on the collection screen for now. That's a spirit gem. There are many for each spirit. Find as many as you can. I see that somewhere on the seas you can raise a spirit's power for 10 gems. The light that seeks your aid grows weaker still. There's no time to lose. 10 gems? So I just got one. There was one in the shop that was like 500 rupees. That's only two. Holy fuck. I need to get 10 in order to strengthen it. That's insane. Oh, nice, Deadfully. What's up? You actually did it. Now we're even closer to getting rich. Long! Hoo-ha! I'm excited. Ugh, he's so self-centered. Well, I sense that man will prove to be an asset and not an anchor in time. You don't say. I hope you're right. Okay, let's quickly set sail back to Merkay Island. Long! All right, off we go. This is so uncomfortable to stream. <laughs> oh well. What's taking so long? I was about to leave you here. Long! What, Lineback? What are you going on about? I suspect that we're hot on the trail of untold wealth. Don't you suspect that the light that needs finding is really a shiny treasure? I really don't think so. Anyway, let's head back to Merkay Island. <laughs> I guess I'll say yes. My favorite Zelda game? I have no idea. I can't really pick. An anchor is an asset if you want to stop your ship. That is true. That's true. Hmm, haven't forgotten anything, have you? Okay, let's be off. Well, let's go. Oh, is there Big Nasty? Nice. I guess I should check out some of the other islands. Oh, Cannon Island. That's McKay. 
Molida Island. Traveler's ship. Is this the whole world? Please tell me this is not the whole... No, this must just be the one region that I'm in. Beetle ship. Let's go talk to Beetle. See what he's got going on. Hard turn to starboard. <laughs> thanks. That matters to me. That is a quarter of the world. Oh, thanks for the spoiler. Hey, see that weird thing that just surfaced along? It's called a sea trap, and we're headed right for it. We can't attack it, so we have only one option. Make the ship jump over it. Tap the jump arrow at the screen's bottom to jump, but only at the right time. God damn it, I thought sailing was going to be a nice time to look at chat. But now I'm going to get fucked if I <laughs> look at chat during this. Really? I got to fuck it. <laughs> How does a ship jump? Anyone want to explain that to me? How ex how exactly does a does a ship jump? I wonder. That's pretty impressive. It's just a gate, Rex. Actually, it wasn't a gate. A gate would have the thing on top too. I'd have to go in between two things for it to be a gate. Want to board this ship, Lonk? Sure. This fucking guy. Oh, welcome to Beetle's shop ship. I deal in anything and everything. How does anything jump, really? <laughs> Fair enough. What are you looking for, huh? I must know. Just tap your selection. What the fuck is that? Oh, I'm currently at a stock, but choice items are... Oh, I touched the screen, I guess. What are you looking for, huh? Uh, what's that? Ship part. Utility handrail. 150 rupees. Uh... Okay. All right. What's that? Zora scale, 30 rupees. This price is crazy. Ah, uh, wasn't this guy in Wind Waker? He's in like every Zelda, pretty much. Most of them. Okay. I don't know what that's for. Is this one 500, just like in the other shop? Good thing, 500 rupees. Collect these and something good is bound to happen. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I should buy the Zora scale or not. I guess. Don't know what it's for, but we got the Zora scale. This rare scale was dropped by a Zora. Yay. I have that now. <laughs> don't know what this handrail is for. I might get it later, I guess. I'm sure he's not going anywhere. I'm going to prep a member's card just for you. The more you buy, the more points you'll earn, and the happier you'll be. I pamper my customers. No other shop offers such rewards, you know. And that brings your point total to one. Try to earn 20 points and earn a silver membership. Beetle never ages or dies because of the events in the world. Convenient? What kind of a sentence was that? What? Oh, I think you just needed punctuation. <laughs> I was trying to figure out what you were trying to say. Very confused for a second. Um, so... I should probably just go back to the main island, but let's check in an island, I guess. Just to see if there's anything good there. That guy only started showing up in Wind Waker. Damn. I thought he was around for the... Some of the uh, N64 ones, at least. Well, I guess he's only in the new ones, then. New-ish. Newer. Alright, what do we have here? Andy, please, we don't need a command for everything. Uh, probably no point to coming here. Baumgarten, Edo's Garage. Okay. Hey, nice to meet you. And not like I don't want to greet you, but I'm here to deliver deliver your mail. Not talk your ear off. Yep, the postman lives for special delivery. And your name is? Got it right here. Uh, isn't it long? I'm sure I'll be carrying special deliveries for you at some point. So I'd appreciate it if you didn't, you know, shoot me with a slingshot. Thanks for understanding. I may also need you to sign for deliveries. Thanks. On that note, see you around the sea, sir. Okay. 
I'm not sure if I'm gonna play Spear Tracks too. I guess it depends how much I like this one and how much people like watching it or something. I don't see why not if people like this one well enough. Shadow's Garage. I guess we'll see what's in here. Welcome to the ship junkyard at Edo's Garage. I'm at... Fuck, I skipped it by mistake. I, oh, he's, I'm at Edo, Master Edo's service or something. I know that Master wants to sell the cannon that he's working on. So come on back later if you're interested in getting your hands on one. Yeah, okay, let's just leave. There's no reason to be here. As I suspected. Yes. What you've seen, Spear Tracks is the same thing, but with trains. <laughs> Alrighty then. Fair enough. To Merkay Island, I guess. What is worth you enjoying watching this a lot more than Breath of the Wild? Really? Huh. Okay. Still don't know if there's something I should be doing about those frogs. Hopefully not. Most of all the players think this is better than Spirit Tracks. Eh, that doesn't mean Spirit Tracks is not worth playing, right? Alright. We made it. One felt more believable than Spirit Tracks. Okay. Um, I could talk to him, but why the fuck would I do that? <laughs> let's just, let's just go to the temple like we're supposed to do. Ignore that fucker. Why does Hyrule need trains anyway? Uh, why does anyone need trains? For transporting goods and transporting people. Both of those are pretty damn good uses for trains. Why, why wouldn't Hyrule benefit from that? Hyrule's no different. It's impressive if they have fucking train technology in what appears to be the Middle Ages, though. Hey, wait, wait! If you push yourself that hard from the beginning, it won't last. I understand wanting to hurry, but don't waste your energy. Don't forget that this cursed temple can suck the life out of you. I know we have to search for clues to find the spirits, but we need some kind of strategy. Just don't end up like this. Hey, you know, uh... I mean, if you say you want to go it alone, then who am I to stop you? There's only one train? I mean, still. To have even one train. <laughs> at this time in history. What? You're trying to put all the work on long Again? If you know it's dangerous, shouldn't you be helping too? Well, yeah, kid. The temple is a little dangerous. Not a place for... Uh, uh, kids. If you go in, well, you might not make it very far already been in here. That's not exactly true. What? Grandpa! I'm impressed he managed to free the spirit of power. You are strong. Even if you follow the ghost ship, you will be fine. Onk! Get up on that altar. You got it. Wait, this way. There we go. I did it! Jinsumi, come on. <laughs> what the fuck? Why? Just why? Rex is a lot more committed to voice acting long. <laughs> I hate it. I hate doing that. I hate voice acting. I'm not doing it anymore. If I do the Carball stream, am I going to do Drop Shot with viewers? With viewers, I don't know. I don't know if I have enough viewers that play Rocket League to get a lobby, but... Maybe. Also, I just skipped something accidentally by pressing L again! Because of the way I have to hold this thing. Hulk's fucking face is so shit. Pretty much everything looks like shit. Not much you can do about it. You got the Phantom Hourglass! Holy shit! That's the thing in the name of the game! We got the thing! It's a mysterious hourglass filled with golden sand. Season ends in four hours. Yeah, that's... I'm so excited for that. For a new season. You now hold the legendary Phantom Hourglass. Long! As long as you carry it, this temple cannot drain the life from you. Uh, okay. Woohoo! 
As long as we have this, we can search for clues for the spirit. <clears throat> However, you are only safe as long as sand remains in the top of the Phantom Hourglass. When all the sand is drained to the bottom, your life too will be drained. It's an hourglass, can't you just flip it over again? No. Once the sand of ours has drained, its power is lost. It needs the light of the sun to restore its mystical power. Ah, I get it. So we have to go outside the temple again. The sand inside the Phantom Hourglass is called the Sand of Hours. The beast you defeated in the Temple of Fire held some grains of it. It is said to be made of force gems of the Great Spirit, the Ocean King. It gives deep strength to whoever hold its, holds its power. From now on, you must defeat monsters and collect their Sand of Hours. What? You're putting me on a timer in dungeons, and if I run out of time, I have to leave and come back? Are you kidding me? For the more sand you place in the hourglass, the longer its power will last. The sea chart we found in this temple showed where to find the captured spirit. If that's the case, then the location of the other two spirits... Hmm. I bet there's another clue hidden somewhere in this temple. I just know it. I won't stop you long! Dive deeper into this mystery, but keep the phantom hourglass in hand. No problem for Speed Game Master Rex. <laughs> Remember how Astrid was saying that the sacred light was fading? We've got to hurry long! So how do you know so much, old man? Hmm. That long story is not yet ready to surface, but all will come in time. For now, you must find the ghost ship. That's right, a mountain of treasure awaits, ready to leap into my pockets. Hop to it long! Put some steam in your engines and get exploring this temple, kid. <sighs> Fine, I'll do everything again. Well, this is going to be interesting. Ten minutes! I've got ten minutes to explore this dungeon. Lovely. Long! Look at the upper left corner of the top screen. This is how long the Phantom Hourglass will protect you from the curse. Find the next clue to the ghost ship before the sand runs out, then escape. That's it. Without the sand, it will start to suck the life out of you. Remember to keep an eye on the time you've got left. <sighs> no, that's 10 hours. This is the door of power. Use my strength to open it. Tap the door and let's go even deeper into the temple. What? Since when did I touch the... Oh god, I'm pressing L. <laughs> my palm. Classic. Well, I guess we're going fast. It's okay. I've gone fast before. I can do this. Great, my battery's dying. You know what's great about the fact that my battery's dying? What's great about the fact that my battery's dying is that the charging port is right where I have to put my fucking hand. So that's lovely. This makes this even more awkward. Amazing. Oh yeah, this isn't bad at all. I love it. Hopefully I don't run out of time because I'm always looking at chat. <laughs> that noise. Hey! Hey, it's an enemy. You know what to do. Wait! Oh! The evil that cursed this temple made these monsters. Phantoms are very dangerous enemies. Their armor is nearly impenetrable and they strike very hard. Does that mean you can't defeat them? There has to be a way. Well, all you can do is sneak by the phantoms so they don't see you. You can watch their movements on your map. This is where the phantoms are. We have to sneak around like thieves, eh? What if we're seen? Rex, don't look here, there's nothing interesting. <laughs> charging before the stream is for losers? It was charged before the stream. In fact, I had it charging up until like a few minutes into playing the game and I, I got frustrated with it and disconnected it. So I've only been running on battery for like, probably two hours. I would say. If they see you, run straight for a safe zone. By safe zone, do you mean those purple spaces on the ground? Oh yeah, the sand stopped moving the hourglass when we were in one. That's right, those purple tiles on the floor are safe zones. This temple's curse makes it a dangerous place, but it's not all that bad. This is a kid's game, I'm sure the timer will be very lenient. Yeah, probably. 
Those safe zones remain as places that evil can't get to. Okay, so if a phantom spots you, just run to a safe zone. That's easy. At Pop Tart Pony 3, comma, space. Right long! Let's just say yes. Make this <laughs> go by more quickly. Let's go long! Don't let a phantom see you. Okay. Oh god, I can't stop pressing L. It's so hard. I don't want to, but I can't help it. Okay, so avoid the chumps and figure out the things. Lighting the torches should open the way. But how am I supposed to light two of them? Hmm. How indeed. How is it possible? Wonder how long it'll take Rex to forget? Forget what? Who goes there? Eek, you've been spotted. Quick, run to a safe zone. And now he forgets I exist. <laughs> Wait, what? I thought there was someone here a second ago. Where'd he go? Hmm. Well, that's weird. I guess I'll just leave then. I guess nothing happened after all. Okay. So that's going to be on a timer. So I don't know if I can do both fast enough. I don't know where the other one is. Thanks for all the Appanatosaurus Rex comments, guys. Since I'm trying to move fast, does that mean you shouldn't at me so I can concentrate? I'm sure it'll be fine. Regardless. What's that? I can't tell. There's not enough pixels. <laughs> I guess it's nothing. Who goes there? Please. Leave. Ah, oh, it's just a cardboard box. <laughs> nice meme. All right. Where's the uh, where's the second torch thing? I don't understand. I only saw one. Um. Uh. I must be able to throw my boomerang over here and hit something. Wow, that's as far as I can see. I think I just hit the guy. <laughs> that's great. And I can't do anything with this. And what? Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. Oh, fuck. He one-shot me. <laughs> it took away a bunch of my time. What the hell? That's bullshit. Try that again, I guess. I don't think that did anything, though. Hmm. I assume I can use those little posts to go across the pit, but I don't have the ability to... To do that yet. I need to get an item first. Where the fuck is the second torch? I don't understand. Oh, it's right there. But the, I, I need a second switch. Or I can just activate that one, come down, boomerang it, and that'll be fine. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. There's nothing there. Uh, here. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I don't know what to do, Mickey. Well, I do now, but I thought I had to activate a second switch because I thought the torch was going to be like in a separate place. I literally did not see that other torch. Because <laughs> I uh, don't have functioning eyeballs. God damn it. There we go. Easy peasy. I wonder how many times I'm going to accidentally take up my boomerang by pressing L with my palm. I'll try to hold the damn gamepad. Probably seven or eight billion. Oh, I guess there was no one there. Whoops. Just, just me overreacting again. Break a red pot to spill its magical contents on the floor. Stand in the puddle to conceal yourself. Okay. Seems reasonable, I guess. So it's like the same as the other safe spots. Got it. Yay, I thinged the do. Now let's go to the door. Oh man, we're running low on time, guys. I don't know about this. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pull this off. Dude, this is gonna take ages. Can you please go to the right? Oh my God. Do I really have to wait for this guy? Seriously? 
at least the timer doesn't run when I'm standing here, I suppose. As long as he keeps going forward, I can stop in that space there. And then wait till he turns around and goes past me very slowly, once again. No one tell you what backseating is? Backseating is when you try to tell the person playing the game what to do. That includes giving tips or advice or helping in any way unless it's requested. Alright. Should be able to get up here before he sees me. Easy game. I wonder if I'm going to get the thing for those posts in this dungeon right now. Oh. What? <laughs> Is that just letting me know he's there? Okay, thanks. I guess. This guy just rotates. That's all. Seems simple enough. Oh, he heard it. This guy's using his ears. That's cheating. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Fuck. I fucked it. Oh, he forgot. Okay. So am I supposed to use that to alert him and then pull the switch? All right. Easy. You'll never catch me. Uh-oh. Never mind. Not uh-oh. It's totally fine. I guess I'll break that just in case I need it. Uh, I'm not getting through fire. Is there a switch down there? There is a switch down there. Oh man, the puzzles! The puzzles! So hard! You okay, buddy? What if I do this? <laughs> you can't do shit. Why does he not, like... <laughs> Oh, that's great. I wish he would go the other way, though. He won't notice me if I stand here, right? Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck off. I just don't want to wait here for a hundred years. Oh, what if I do this? Just hit the wall. Make noise up there. You didn't hear that? Okay. Thanks for that. Good stuff. Can you please walk faster? Holy fuck. Thanks. I should have watched the past that the phantoms walked more carefully. They're patrolling the same areas again and again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, but he can't get in here because I flipped the switch. <laughs> get fucked. I don't know where I'm supposed to go, though. Uh, oh, I guess I have to wait for him to go by. Is that... F Hard to tell, but I want to see if... Hmm. I guess I'm supposed to come back this way and then go around again? I have you now. I don't know about that, bud. <laughs> I don't know about that. What a god. What a god gamer. Get wrecked. Oh, there's a thing there. I guess I'll get that just in case. Might come in handy at some point. There we go. Still don't have bombs, so I can't... I guess this would just be a shortcut. Wait, what? Oh, is there a switch in there or something? What? Oh, can I, like, trap him? Can I... I don't understand. What's gonna happen here? I clearly can't get past that. Guess I'll wait here. See where he goes. Okay, he goes there and then he turns around. I don't get this. I don't have anything to put on that. I don't have anything that I can place down. Rex memory? Uh, maybe? <laughs> I have no idea what it wants me to do here. There's nothing in there. There's no way I can get in there. What the heck? 
What? My goal is to get a small key. I didn't get one, did I? And forget about it. No, I'm not that dumbo. Um, Valva? No, no, no Valva. Oh, if I can get him to chase after me, he'll stand on that button and I can go inside while he's standing there. But then I'll be trapped. <laughs> so, fuck me, I guess. Oh, he's not doing it! What the fuck? It didn't work! It didn't work! It doesn't even count him as standing on the button. It doesn't care that he's standing on it at all. He definitely stood on it at some point, but he didn't, uh... He didn't activate it. Yeah, no, he doesn't activate that at all. Also, fuck. <laughs> Whoops. I did an oopsie. Hold on, I'm trying to move stuff around again. <sighs> one switch puzzle. <laughs> yeah, GG. Can't beat the one switch puzzle. Game over. Unless this does something. I didn't think it actually did. I thought it just, like, distracted him. But maybe it does. Hmm. I don't see it. I don't see anything. Get fucked! Three minutes left. Yeah, we're, we're screwed. Maybe it opens that? I, I don't know. What are you gonna do, chump? Oh wait, he opened the thing. Wait, what? Why is that one open now? Oh, it's not. Hello? <laughs> I can actually hit him. That's great. Uh, I have no idea what to do here. I have no idea what to do. I assume I can't attack that. I can't put my boomerang there. I can't put any, I don't have any items to put there. What the hell? I don't understand. Good use of time. <laughs> it has to be that one switch. Or maybe the switch up in the top left corner of the first guy's area. Maybe I have to hit both switches. Maybe that's all it is. Literal genius. The phantoms hear when a switch is hit. Hit switches quietly or lure them away with sound. Yeah, about that. <laughs> well, I feel Dumbo. I've got to complete the rest of the dungeon before <laughs> running out of time. Oh my god, I have no time left. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go! One minute left. I'm gonna do all my thinking on the safe spots. I have no time for this guy, I got it. Okay, let's go this way. Hit that. Go behind him. Fuck, I still have to get a key. Oh, I just got the key. I have to get the key, or go into the key door, get stuff, come out and do something else. Oh my god. One trillion IQ. Rex, have you saved? Is that a thing? I assumed it was auto-saving. Holy fuck, there's a whole floor! There's a whole floor I have to do! <laughs> this is impossible! There's nothing I can do. There's no way. I love that Rex didn't see the room that was just a square. What? I don't understand. The clue to the ghost ship rests on this floor, just a little farther. Yeah, about that. About that. That's gonna be a problem for us. Oh? It's the Triforce, I guess? <laughs> see what that says. Offer up the Force Gems on the sacred, pe sacred pedestals. Oh, I guess I can't finish this yet. I just need to get the... 
the next hint and leave, so maybe I will have enough time. Maybe it'll be real quick. God damn it, god damn it, god damn it, where do you want me to go? Uh, this. Oh no, it's too high! Who goes there? Oh no! There's... what? <laughs> where is he? He has me now, apparently. Found a force gem, take it away quietly. Oh, all the force gems are in here. Okay. That is a force gem, stolen from the evil king. The ocean king, by the hands of evil. I need the power of force gems to open a door and delve deeper. So, what are you supposed to do with this force gem? <laughs> I can see it, over there! There are the pedestals where the force gems go. Place all force gems here and the door will open. Oh, so all I have to do is take the force gems. Be careful, you'll move a lot slower when you're carrying a big force gem. If a phantom sees you and you don't think you can get away, don't be a hero, drop the force gem and run to a safe zone. Simple, right? Long! Look out for the phantoms and lug those force gems around. This is not possible with 25 seconds. This is impossible. I don't have enough time left. <laughs> I'm fucked. What am I supposed to do? Oh my god, I'm so slow. 24 seconds, rip. Use your ability. Bliss. It better not reset the whole dungeon. I'm gonna be so mad if it resets the whole dungeon, dude. I'm gonna be the saltiest man alive. Well, that used half my time. More than half my time. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. <laughs> Prepare to be really mad. God damn it. Give me my key! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. My time's up, so... Oh, it just starts hurting me! Forgot about that. But yeah, it's probably gonna kill me. You found a force gem, take it away quietly. Yeah, about that. I forgot that it just starts hurting me. Well, I'm gonna die, so... Fuck. Guess I'll just die and see what happens. Game over. Please tell me. It saved my progress. Please. Please, game. I beg you. Don't make me redo everything. Pliss. Uh, I forget what we do here. Uh, am I going the right way? Wasn't I supposed to go in a special door? Where was that again? Back here? I'm so lost. I thought I was supposed to go up there. Thank fuck there's a continue button because Rex still hasn't hard saved. It doesn't seem like I can. I can only save and quit. The only way to save is to quit, so there's no way that's required. Where the fuck is the door? Was it over here? Or... Oh god, this is... I'm past the door. I've got to read. I forgot about this. This is so long ago that I forgot about it. Oh my god. I can't believe I have to redo even this. That's nuts. Holy fuck. <laughs> Goldfish. That's <laughs> uh, true. I'm a, I'm a goldfish. Can't help it. Look down here, you dumbo. Alright, this is probably a dumb thing that I'm doing, but... I have to. Wait, what? I didn't open that yet? Fuck. God damn it. What did I forget to do to open that? I forgot something. <laughs> Thank you, Six Funk, for the Twitch Prime sub. I appreciate it. So long ago, not even 10 minutes. It was like 15 minutes ago. The timer in game doesn't... Take into account the time I spend standing on the safe spots. It was ages ago. 
<laughs> Thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate it. All right. Now let's go do the thing. Oh, God, there's two. Oh, God, the other one came. Uh, where am I going again? Up here. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> Jesus. Well, that worked somehow. Practically 15 minutes, guys. That's fucking ages. That's years. That might as well be years. Hey, how did he not hear that? I don't understand. Okay, then. Uh, wait, how do I get that open again? Oh, yeah, the switch behind the guard. Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> Go down into the right. Down into the right. Oh, my God. I got away. Insane. Insane. God gamer. Uh-oh. Okay, it's fine. Okay, so... There's two ways of doing this, but let's do this way. Clutch. You better believe it was clutch. That's how I roll. Oh, I guess you do have to go this way. Oh, well. I wonder if while he's looking around, I can slip out past him. Aha! That's... I was wondering about that. But I was afraid to try it earlier. It seems to work just fine. Alright, I think he's gonna forget I exist here in a sec. Yep, he forgot. He's Dumbo. 15 minutes, that's years. I mean, it's basically years. Might as well be years is what I'm saying. Right, like, oh God. <laughs> oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Okay, it's fine. I almost fucked that a little bit. But then I didn't, so it's okay. It's fine. Wow, the enemy is dumber than Rex. <laughs> it's a pretty impressive accomplishment, isn't it? All right. Now we just have to get the three things. I know where two of them are, so... Let's start by getting this one, I guess. Should be pretty easy. Does that guy go in this direction? Oh, he's gonna come up here, isn't he? Let's just toss it there and then wait for him to go around and then go behind him. The strats, man, the strats. God gamer, as always. Okay. That's one. I guess there's one in the bottom left corner somewhere. That would make the most sense. I don't know if killing that guy is how you get the key or what. I thought I could just boomerang it off his back or something, but doesn't seem like it. This is bad. Wait, no, it's not. I'm gonna waste a lot of time though. Ugh. Hurry up! Hurry up! Go! I can't get the key off him, right? No, it doesn't seem like it. Alright, up here. Press the switch. A trap door. Hmm. Interesting. So I can fuck the guard? Oh god, this is wasting so much time. That's great, Fernox. Thanks for censoring that for us. It would have been tragic if you hadn't put that hyphen there. No, don't worry about it. Nothing happened. Just keep going forward. <laughs> That's how you get the key. The key falls off as he's going in the hole. That makes sense. Got a small key. All right. I don't know what that corpse would have said, but just leave him alone. And this is the last one. GG. Man, you really gotta, you really gotta go fast in these things. I already knew the solution. I'm already half done. Or my time is already almost half gone. Jeez. It's gonna be half gone by the time I go pick up that third one. He wanted to die so badly. <laughs> yeah, he saw the hole. He saw it appear right in front of his eyes. And he still went for it. 
Oh, so I have to go around and drop in in order for that to work out? Okay. Please, you're irrelevant. I'm going up here anyway. Oh, the fire turned on. Uh, never mind. That's kind of dumb. That's not fair. So if a guard sees you, the fire turns on. That's bullshit. Like what? Safe spot? What safe spot? Rex blind? You mean Rex memory? I remember that I have to come up here and drop in from this direction. And then, wait, what? What? I can't hit that though. What? Oh, it's timed. I thought they were mo moving up when I got close. Also, the thing is here. Oh my God. <sighs> Holy I thought it was up there behind the spiked area. And I also thought that the spikes were on a proximity sensor, unless you approach from the other side. Holy shit. Wow. I'm so... <laughs> I'm distracted. It's hard. It's hard to play video games and stream at the same time. You guys don't understand. It's difficult. <laughs> Such a god gamer. Thanks. I'm glad you think so. This door just won't open for us. The design is different from the last door. Maybe we need another spirit's house. House. Help. I got a star for trying. Thanks, man. Huh? Wait. There's no fog in this room. Look. The hourglass has stopped and your life force isn't being drained. The place isn't cursed yet. I think we can finally relax. Oh, all right. Distractions while streaming erases memories confirmed. I mean, it probably has an effect. Oh, you can get time from pots? Okay. That's neat. You got the Northwestern Sea Charge. Nice. Wait, is that the whole map? <laughs> So this is actually a quarter of the map down here? This game's tiny. Now you can explore a new area of the sea. Banana and attempt was made Rex. That's what they call me. We got another sea chart, but it looks different from the last one. Maybe now we can explore new areas of the sea? Let's show line back. All right. So that returns to the beginning, but what's out here? Could be anything. What? Why would I want to... Well, that's lame. Alright. Guess we'll take the teleport. I think I'm going to stop now, uh, just shy of four hours, and take a break for a few hours, get some food, relax for a bit, and then stream some Rocket League tonight. And then starting again tomorrow afternoon, we'll get back to streaming this at a more reasonable time, I think. Because otherwise my sleep schedule is not ever going to get fixed. I want to sleep at a time... Sleep at a time. I want to stream at a time that works for my NA viewers for at least, like, a week at the end of this month. Like, I've been streaming at a shitty time for all those people. Like, all month. Basically, for three weeks. <laughs> got like 15 minutes of stream today because of stupid work meetings. Nice. What's my time zone? Newfoundland. Uh, wow, that is interesting that this looks like that. That's what it looks like on the gamepad, too. That's real weird. I will save my progress. Rip you viewers. Yeah, sorry. It'll be pretty late for you guys, but if you're a night owl like me, you can still make it. Is this the new Zelda on Switch? Those graphics look amazing. <laughs> All right. Yeah, sorry, a bit short this time, but like I said, I really need to pick a day to try to fix my sleep schedule, and I woke up pretty late today, so why not today? Especially with the new Rocket League content coming out. Probably a good time. Not even four hours stream. Uh, I actually did that earlier, Harvest. I figured out a way to do it without risking it. But Rex, you're moderately competent in that car ball. That's no fun. I know, I know. You guys like to watch me suck at games. But anyway, 
We're done for now. I'm pretty hungry. I uh, don't want to go too long because then I'll be so tired by later that I uh, won't have the energy to stream. So, let me see if there's anyone worth rating. See if there's any non-shit streamers online. Probably not. I'm pretty much the only good streamer, right, guys? <laughs> uh, who's on my following page? You can see if I can carbobble with someone else. I was thinking about that. I was thinking I would just, like, ask a few people, see if anyone wants to join me for a couple hours or something. If not, then I'll just play myself. No friends is okay. Who needs friends? Um, oh, perfect. Let's raid, uh, let's raid Elegy again. Elegy's still doing a Zelda marathon. He's playing Oracle of Ages right now. Him and his roommate are doing a... 168 hour marathon where they're switching out for 12 hour shifts. They're playing a shit ton of Zelda games. Let's go raid him. He's also a uh, really talented voice actor and all that stuff. I always mention that when I raid him because he's he's so good at that shit. He's very entertaining. Let's go say, um, what do we want to raid him with? I don't know. Viewer games? Uh, we'll see. Maybe if we get enough people or something. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to raid with. How about... <laughs> How about do your best little girl impression? He's going to anyway, but... <laughs> that's that's That works for me. Thank you guys for watching. I'll be back later, probably. Hopefully. And, uh... I don't know. Have, have, a, good, have a good day. Bye, guys.